How many shrimps do you have to eat before you make your skin turn pink? Eat too much and you'll get sick. Shrimps are pretty rich. あいつらはピンク、動物園でおもったピンク食べ物で。そうなんだ。実は私はタラコが大好きプラスエビカに食べよう。ピンク色になるの？だからみんな違う色。人間って勘違いしてるよね。Black, white, green or blue。Show off your natural hue. Flamingo, oh 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 oh. If you're multicolored, that's cool too. ボーリングベスタイムフレミンゴ。フラミンゴ。意味不明だけど面白いでしょ。日色に染まった世界。今日も地球のどこかでエビをむしゃむしゃ食べて。フラミンゴはピンク色に染まっていくぜ。1 2 3 Does perfect even mean? Is there even such a thing? Oh, can we switch up all the rules? And imagine a utopia. A darling, I'm just so fed up with these expectations. They keep weighing me down. My heart is begging me to get the hell out. 
expectations, they keep weighing me down My heart is begging me to get the hell out of my head I'm blind, I live inside the upside down
Hello. Hello. We said, brother Adir and I up to no good lies. Uh, I just said you've been causing chaos, which is not lies and slander. It is 100% true. Um, so I'm just going to start out by saying, yes, my lighting is different. Yes, it's off um, because Squeaker apparently is in a mood today and she doesn't like this light that I usually have on over here being on right now. So um, things are a bit off, but we're going to make our best with it. We're going to make do with it. We're going to we're going to do the best that we can with it. But hi, hello. How's it? Ader, Potato, Mrs. Fatal, Looting, Blight, Stir, Mr. Fatal, Melodia, and... Shit, that was Daddy. Daddy's... Okay, there it is. Dad was like, I was like, wait a minute. I didn't read the name, but it just showed up. Guys, thank you so much for those hosts. While you still can. While you still can, because hosts are going away in less than two weeks, because Twitch sucks. I do hate lights most days, actually most days. She just doesn't like when she's going to bed, she, she likes having control over this lamp because it's uh, like there's a button that you can press on the floor to turn it on and off. And so she likes being in control of it and she doesn't like it. Um, but I use it when I'm streaming because I have the two ring lights. And so this half of my face and this part of my face are lit up, but this part of my face is not very lit up. And the only reason I have any kind of light over here is because of this monitor right here, which I'm currently playing the game on. So it's kind of working out. It was a me. Yes, I remembered. So I need a fi the fire to make more light. No, 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 no. It's okay. It's okay. It's fine. It's purple. It's because of the it's Dreamlight Valley. So um, the screen that I'm on has more of a bluish purple hue. So yeah. Is Stack Up stuff uh, the month of October? Stack Up is November. Stack Up is November. Um, I will be like the link accepts donations. Um, like my campaign is live. And so donations are accepted. But um, I won't be doing any incentives or uh, or anything like that until until November. So it's a punk. Hey, hi, you. Hi, we has party. Wait, why are we having a party? We're not having a party. What are you guys talking about? Party? No, there's no party. There's no party. There's no party. No, 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 no. I'm looking forward to it. Me too. I am super psyched. Also, because I have a lot of uh, streamers in my team now, I have um, a lot of potential raid targets because I'm definitely going to try and send you guys over to new faces of people that I work with, but also that are also promoting um, positivity with with uh, with stack up. I'm super excited. I still can't talk about how much I love this job. I've come to beat people up. It's fatal. Are you home safely? That's OK, Melodia. Do what you got to do. Take care of the kiddo. Yes, I'm very much looking forward to stack up. Um, I've got the incentives all planned out. I've got milestones planned out. I've even got milestones. If y'all decide that you want to go absolutely fucking ham and smash this goal like the last one the like last year we went for a thousand dollars and you and you guys tripled it so i don't think we're gonna triple this year's goal but um if you guys do hit five thousand and keep going i do have additional milestones planned for that but you know how's your head feeling my head's fine my head's fine um I was tired today but i did t lay down and take a nap um although it wasn't very a very restful nap because the cat decided that he was going to climb on top of the freezer where all the advanced GG uh, shakers are and knocked a couple of them down. It scared the living bejesus out of me. I'm doing okay, Looney. How are you doing? I'm off to get food by. Ooh, sushi. I always want sushi. It doesn't matter how full I am. I mean, I had salmon for dinner, not raw salmon, cooked salmon. I had salmon for dinner, but I still like sushi. Mm. Guys, if you triple the $5,000 goal and make it $15,000, I don't know what I'll do. You guys wanted to have a hot tub stream, but I don't have access to a hot tub. And even though I have a kiddie pool, there is no way I'd be able to fit it in this. It, like, I literally have like a, the curtain is right here. Like the length of my arm. I am touching the curtain right now. See, I can, I can, I can pick it up. Um... So there is really not any place to fit a uh, a kiddie pool in here. Uh, but I'll tell you what, whenever I get like when we when we finally move and I have my stream space, 
um, I will figure something out because I don't like, I know that it would be easy for me to just like cheese it and just do like a, like a, a green screen. But I feel like if I'm going to reward you guys for raising 10,000 or $15,000 for stack up with a hot tub stream, I'm going to do my best to be a little bit more, uh, authentic with it. You know, VTuber hot tub. I could try and do a VTuber hot tub, but I really feel like doing sir in a hot tub might be a bit of a cop out for me. I feel like people would be disappointed and not feel like it was worth it. I mean, it's for charity, but you know, I don't know. I don't know. I think daddy got it. Look, okay, fine, 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 fine. You guys raise $15,000 and I will VTube hot, VTuber hot tub, okay? I, sir in a hot tub, we'll do it, okay? I'd personally find it hilarious, but that's just my opinion. I mean, that would be quite an impression, wouldn't it? If somebody comes into a stream and I'm in the hot, because I would be in the hot tub and uh, and pool party or whatever um, category. And then somebody just hops in. It's not it's not a chick in a hot tub. It's not a, it, it, it's it's PNG tuber, sir, in a hot tub. I'd even I'd even get him like a, a bikini. I'll get him a bikini for uh, for his PNG avatar. See, sir, naked booty all the time. Yeah, that's fair. That's fair. That's fair. I think it's fine if you're clear about what it means. Yes, that's fair. <laughs> it's that's hilarious. I definitely want to see that. Well, well, then maybe we'll add it to the incentives list. I don't expect fifteen thousand dollars. Holy shit! I would, I would probably cry if you guys raised fifteen thousand dollars. I would probably cry, um, because that is just. I was blown away last year, and I think every time you guys come out with charity stuff, I'm just blown away with the generosity and the love and outpouring support that I get from you guys, and the and like that's always what I wanted to do. If I ever got a platform, I always told myself I would use it for good and I do charity and things like that. And so being able to see that impact, especially with stack up, because it's not like, oh, 10 cents of every dollar goes to goes to helping. But no, it's 85 percent of the funds that we raise every year. 85 percent goes to those programs or more because we do everything we can to keep administrative costs low. And so it's it's just it's phenomenal to see the good that you guys are actually doing and the people that you're actually impacting and i've been told that our second crate that because last year when we raised three thousand dollars we sponsored two crates if we make it um or uh if we make it our second crate is scheduled to go out in uh in no in november as well so i'll be able to share that with you guys and you know that i'm i'm super excited super excited my brother wore a bikini once and it was amazing <laughs> I can't do bikinis anymore. They don't make. I can't find a bikini that is supportive enough. I'll, I'll say that um, because all these bikinis that are out there, they're for like girls that they're, they're, they're like, they're like this, this big. And that's just, that's it. That is, I have too much booba for that. Okay. Like I have way too much booba for that. Clown nipples aside, I have way too much booba for that. They're just spilling out all over the damn place, and I just I can't. Yeah, it's like a tiny cup for a booba. And it's like, no. No. Like, just because I have big booba does not mean that I don't want to wear a cute swimsuit. Bikini only meant to cover a nipple. No, th those are pasties. Those are pasties, Fatal. I mean, they make those too. <laughs> Can't find them in my size either. I will say the one place that I've been able to find stuff that I'm actually liking. Um, so Sturm being the ever supportive husband that he is, um, he got me a subscription to Adore Me, which uh, um, has like loungewear, but also like bras and underwear sets, but also bathing suits. And they have them in larger sizes. Like, so it's not just, they, they do have certain designs that are A to like double or triple D. But they also have sizes that go up to like H, I, like your G, H, I, J, and I think K. And that's more where I'm at. Sir, who's that loser? Don't you talk about my, well, yeah, he hasn't brought me bed, brought me bread in a while, so. But no, he's not a loser. He's awesome. He's great. Uh, oh boy, oh boy. <laughs> um, but yeah, he, he got me a subscription so that I could 
get some nice things for me and a little for him. He benefits. He benefits a little bit. But like stuff that I could feel comfortable in because I've had nothing but nursing bras for the past two years and nursing bras are not super supportive. They have a function, but they're not super supportive and definitely not super sexy. Definitely not sexy. That is Fatal. Fatal's, Fatal's always in a mood because Fatal comes home from work and is just like, ah, all the aggravation from work. Ah. I go clothes shopping for Mrs. Fatal so she doesn't have to feel self-conscious. That's sweet. That's sweet. I just don't like I I hate it that like all the all the bras and so all the like underwear and stuff that seems to be for uh, women that have my bra size. They're just not fun. I want fun bras. I want fun bras with cool colors and patterns, not just nudes and black, white, tan. Like I like I like stuff with a little bit of pizzazz and you know, I want fun underwear, damn it. But also fuck Victoria's Secret. Not that they have my size either, but fuck Victoria's Secret. He really does know my size better than I do. Oh, that's so cute. That's so cute. Oh, yes. Uh, don't forget, um, we're starting tonight Stream Raiders with a boss battle. So I need everybody to get their little asses over into Stream Raiders so that we defeat this boss. So Victoria's Secret is bullshit. It is. I actually have been watching the documentary that's on Hulu. Oh, God. I let Purple do her own shopping. Whatever works, you know? Oh, what? I must watch. Oh, yeah. It's it's a, it's a small, like, docu-series. I think there's, like, four or five episodes. But it's, uh... I'm, I'm only in the middle of the second episode because I can't... I don't feel comfortable watching it with the kids awake understandably so um <laughs> and since i started working uh for stack up i've been mostly busy during the day and then the only time that i really get to myself other than in the evenings is uh when she goes down for a nap and lately uh i've been taking a nap or i've been busy and having meetings and stuff because i then you know i don't have a screaming baby while i'm trying to have meetings <laughs> so purple likes the sexy mantis <laughs> hey nothing wrong with that Nothing wrong with that. I'm trying to get more sexy mantis as well, or not mantis. Oh wait, man panties. Is that what you're talking about? Man panties. I'm learning so much about my chat right now. I love you guys. You're great. Okay. Um, so I have one more story to share because it was really cute. And then uh we can go ahead and hop into the Dreamlight Valley because I have so much I need to do. So very much I need to do. Um so Bug got off the bus today. I like sexy boxers. Boxers for easy access. Uno mas, yeah, uno mas. Um, I was ever able to buy bras and stores. <laughs> boy shorts is best underwear, just a final note. I feel like boy shorts uh, ride up for me and maybe it's just because I got the thick, the, maybe just like my thick thighs or something, but I feel like boy shorts ride up for me. I just like bikini. I don't like thongs. They get up in my butt. I'd rather just get the laser cut ones so that I, I don't have to worry about seams because that was the whole argument for thongs. I just, I don't need to feel like I got a wedgie that the whole time. It's just not my thing. Oh, I know this story. I got the, yeah. <laughs> so, um, all right. So Bug got off the bus today. And when he gets off the bus, he's holding this little piece of paper. And um, so he gets off the bus and he gives me a big hug and we're walking back to the house. And I was like, hey, what's this? What is this? And he shows me, and it's a card. And on the front of it, it says, not spelled correctly, but they're in second grade, so you know, but it says tornado. And there's a picture of a tornado and Wally. -E. And those are t Bug's two favorite things right now tornadoes, Wally. -E. That's what he's all about right now. And you open up the card, and inside it says, from Morgan to Bug. And Morgan is this girl in his class that he is he 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 made friends with all of the girls in his class because and I quote girls are prettier than boys. So right now he thinks girls are prettier than than boys or at least the girls in his class are prettier than the boys in his class. And so he's like, I, I want to make friends with all the girls. So he made friends with this girl, Morgan, and she made him this card and there's tornadoes on the inside of it, too. And then on the other page, it says 
love you. Bug got himself a girlfriend. Bug got fucking game. Like, I know there's seven, but like, it was just so cute. Like, I remember getting, I remember my first crush. I was in kindergarten when I had my first boy crush. You guys know my, no, he's just my kid. Yeah, that's true. He is definitely Sturb's kid. He got game. I'm melting. It's so fucking adorable. <laughs> uh, but yeah, so, uh, so he's like, you know, I really wish I could call her on Skype and talk to her, but I don't have her number and I just had to. <laughs> I yeah I remember I had my first my first crush when I was in kindergarten I remember his name I remember his full name um <laughs> his name was Michael I won't say his full name I won't dox him but like his name was Michael and I like I remember his full name like first middle last but um I, I remember his name was Michael and you guys know how my favorite number is 73 you want to know why? Because that was his bus number. His bus number was 73, and that became my favorite number. And then it, it just stuck. <laughs> That's why. <laughs> but I, I remember I was, I was, uh, when my parents were getting ready to, what a weirdo, fuck off. <laughs> I was four. <laughs> um, I, uh, my first crush was Mindy down the, sh down the lane and she had the first bra in a class at 10. Ooh. Sturm, that's mean. Quit is a D to weirdo. Are you guys being mean to me? Is it because you gave me so much love the last two streams so now it's okay to be mean to me? Because <laughs> you did 69 times four times. Blight, I was four. Blight, I was four. Oh my god. Do you need us to shower you and things again? No, no, that's not what I'm saying. That is not what I'm saying. That is not what I'm saying. <laughs> Look, Blight already got his emo. Blight can't, like, Blight doesn't need anything more from me right now, okay? <laughs> oh my god. Um, I didn't hear the four year old. Yeah, I was in kindergarten, Blight. I was four. <laughs> Weirdo is a good thing around here. I love you guys. I love you all. See, it, look, look, I've been wearing this every day. I love it. I mean, it's for me too. It's not just for you guys, but yeah. Wait, ask purple. Wait, ask purple for what? Ask purple for what? About her first crush? Please do tell, because I'm curious. I'm curious. We're all weird down here. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. We are. We're all weird. And it's okay, because weird is my kind of flavor, you know? It's boring to be just... Na normal. Look at that booty. Look at that sir booty goodness. Yeah, we gonna get banned. Yeah, just like uh, just like a hundred and fifty, uh, or what's that? I don't know, five hundred more of those, Adir. You'll get it. <laughs> She's out here. Oh, jeez. <laughs> Don't be oh, suspicious. Don't be suspicious. Don't be suspicious. Don't be suspicious. Don't be suspicious. Melodian, no. <gasps> nice. Nice. Imagine getting BB-8 in Disney Dream Life. Oh my god, I would die. Guys, stop it. What are you doing? Nice. Hi. How are you? How are you doing? Volk! Another friendo. My goodness, I'm getting all the friendos in tonight. That would be epic if they put Star Wars, if they put, if they put BB-8 in, I would have a hard time choosing between BB-8 and, and Wally. I'm not going to lie. How we doing? We doing okay. We doing okay. How are you doing, Volk? I'm just decorating the game right, right now. Yeah, that's what I'm about to be doing. I'm going to be doing a lot of uh, gathering, a lot of sticks, and uh, and probably a lot of a, a lot of decorating because I, I, I honestly, I don't know. Wally and EB8, BB8. Oh yeah, uh, Bugs' head would explode. He just got Wally in the game the other uh, the other day when he was playing, and he was so proud of himself. Ooh, okay, we got sixteen of y'all in here, guys. This is this is gonna be rough. We'll see. We'll see how this goes. You lost two berry butches to glitch to glitches. Ooh, that sucks. I didn't know that was a thing. I didn't know that could happen. Doing good. Fought with the devs again all day. All day again. Oh, I'm sorry. How you feeling today? I've got 
now that like so potato asked me earlier and like now i'm kind of like I've got a little bit of a headache climbing in but i'll be okay punk we're not going to talk about that we're not going to fight about that we're not going to fight about that harry potter went a lot meant a lot more to me growing up um but jk rowling's a piece of shit so she can't ever take away what harry potter meant to me um but she sucks are you sure coin am i sure what am i sure what Ooh, victory good job guys look at you look at you go oh sturm sturm carried everything sturm got the most kills sturm got the most assists it was probably the only one left because there's one ally left sturm did we're not gonna fight about it because you're right sturm i will i'm just i have no you're not i never watched harry potter don't watch it's it the blight blight hey i would say don't watch it don't watch it the books are better but don't don't give your money to her go to the library and get the books Durham had a mech and an epic orc slayer oh okay all right all right all right I used to read harry potter when i was in high school and oh boy roll it yeah rolling just Yeah. Reading the books of it. Yeah. Pre-owned. Uh, I mean, I guess you could do pre-owned. I guess you could do pre-owned. You could also just go to the library. Free. 100% free. But yeah, support your local library. We love libraries. In fact, in fact, one of the uh, one of the streamers that uh, that I brought on for stack up is a librarian. And she she uses um she uses she like puts up displays and stuff at the library focusing on like gaming and wow. support and like supporting mental health which i thought was super cool when she talked about it which is one of the reasons i reached out to her she's really cool too uh crap what do i have uh, necromancers and tanks okay i can put a tank down because i just put a necro down so we'll do it tank 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 oh huh? fuck nuggets where do i, I guess uh, I guess I'm going to follow Sturm's lead because Sturm put one up here. All right, we're going to we're going to vibe here because I was I wasn't sure what side to go on because there's a little bit of a blockade here. So I feel like I should put things there. Was Punk talking shit about me? He said something and then told me to ask you about something and then mention the fact that you weren't here. So possibly but i also don't want to accuse him of something that he may not have been doing but we were talking about first crushes so hi purple don't fuck the nuggies yet nuggies nuggies don't need to be fucked so so all right um stream raiders is set up next battle is running let's switch over to the game all right i need to make a list i need to make a note of the shit that i need to get these people let me open up my notepad real quick. All right, so let me see. So Maui, grilled fish entree, mushrooms and souls. Oh, I wait. No, we we did this. We did that on stream uh, yesterday, where I opened up, forgot the the last zone. So I have all I have all the zones now. I have nuggies in the freezer. We also have nuggies in the freezer. Ooh, that's a thing I need to remind myself. I need to check the, the stuff for Butcher Box because that's going to order soon. All right. Ariel wants a vegetarian taco. Red. Why do you always want fabric every single day? You not Ted. Why did I put Ted? It's supposed to be red coin. Oh, my God. All right. Ursula. What does she want? peanut butter waffles Ooh, all right peanut butter waffles blue marsh milkweed and creamy soup which i don't know how to make i don't know how to make that one butter 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 mushroom mushroom oh fucking gothel fucking gothel Ugh. shiny sit fuck you fuck you potato she wants to eat potato she wants potato leek soup and she wants a cucumber. Of course she fucking does. It's the only dick she's going to get. 
Peanut butter waffles? Fuck yeah. Ooh, peanut butter waffles. So good. Scrooge is another fantastic deal for you when you get a significant cut of the rewards. Oh, does he? Does he now? Does he now? Do I get more than 2,000 gold? All right. Donald wants a bream. Sake sushi. I can't do that yet. And a green passion lily. Okay. I think that's it. Yep, yep, yep. Okay. Oh, yeah. She wants a cucumber. That's the only dick she's going to get. Don't worry, potato. I won't let her come after you. All right. Um, Let's go to the store. Let's go see. Actually, I've already been to the store. I don't need to do this, but I'm, I'm still going to go. But like... Welcome in, Johnny. How you doing? Thank you for the host. She wants to eat me, but I'm not a MILF. She's not a MILF potato. That's a technicality if I ever saw one. I want this so bad, but I'm not... One, I'm not going to spend 12000 on it. And two, and two... It's a reward that you can get from Ariel. It's just a different color. It's green instead of pink. And I will take the green. Oh no, she's a MILF. She is not a MILF. She is not a mom. I resent that. She's not a mom. Also, these are really cute, but not for 19,000. Technically, she raised Rapunzel. She kidnapped and gaslit and mentally... I don't remember this being here. I want that. Oh. Greetings, neighbor. I don't want that. Then I don't have to worry about all my counters not matching. Give me that. Whoa. Only 600 gold? Good I'll fucking right take now. that. Whoa. Whoa. Eight grand. Whoa. Whoa. 23. Oh my God. Whoa. Those are cool. What's this? You can craft. You can craft count. I hate oh, everything. The it's fine. Are going to love this rain. It's not, I swear to God, if I walk outside and it's not raining, Minnie. I swear to God. I swear to God. Scrudge. Fine, then she's a cougar. Okay, cougar. Cougar is someone that, like, actually seeks out sex, though. She doesn't seem to seek out sex. She doesn't really seem to give a shit about that. She just wants to be young and beautiful. But it doesn't really seem to have any purpose, you know? Fight, fight, fight. <laughs> when she kidnapped her, she did raise her like a daughter. I mean, she gaslit the fuck out of her, but yeah, she did. She did on a technicality. She did. Oh, I need to move these. Mm. I need to rearrange my garden. I don't have a room. That's a problem. I mean, some parents do that. Well, it's bad. They shouldn't. Not the best mom, but still a mom. All right, all right. You got fine. You win. Seems that items can cycle back through Scrooge's shop. If so, if the, uh, if that's helpful. Oh yeah, I think they can because I've definitely seen some repeat things in there. There's a um, I guess it's from Toy Story, but it's like a a spaceship window or something. I've seen that in my shop at least three times. I've never bought it, but I've seen it in there repeatedly. All right, I need. I need to go get mini and I guess do some digging because I need clay. Badly, I need clay. 200 fucking clay for mini. 200 clay! Bye, Wally. Bye, Wally. Alright, let me. Oh, I did organize my, uh. I did organize my food. I did that. I organized it, so now it's all. Nice. Look, okay, so look, so look. I've got all of my fruits are in this one. All my fruit. Okay, so I've got fruit. Okay, fruit. Um, I've been debating keeping a second stack, but I'm not sure I'm going to. If you're going to go clay digging, there's going to be... That's going to be your whole stream. Maybe. Maybe. I'll probably only do it for a little bit. Because that's going to be real fucking boring. Um, and then this is all my veggies. All my veggies. I only have one cucumber, Gotham. And you want me to fuck you? You can't get. You can't have my one cucumber. Fuck you, bitch. Finally cool off here, and now I can have the windows open. Please. This is all my like herbs and grain, and then peanuts because I didn't look. There's this is just the extra shit. It was supposed to be just herbs, but it's like all the extra shit that I don't have room for. And then I've got both of these are fish. So I've got a whole bunch of fish in here. 
And then this is like my shellfish. Wait, no, that's not my shellfish. That's um, that's the stuff I can buy from Remy and Overflow. And then this is my shellfish and seaweed. So I um, I organized a little bit. All right, what was I gonna do? Shit. Guys, I had a squirrel moment. Mini! I need to go get mini. I need to go get mini. And we need to go dig stuff and pick up and pick up sticks. Uh, mini, where are you? It's your quest. You're gonna go through this misery with me. Mini. Alright, Mickey's there. Where's 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 Mini? Is she in the she's in the restaurant. She's in the restaurant. Okay. That's not the restaurant. Wait, no, she's not in the restaurant. She's at Scrooge's shop. I moved stuff. Hold on. That's right, she was shopping. It was 105 yesterday. Holy fuck. Does she have the dig trait for me? Yeah, I made her my dig buddy. I made her my digging buddy. Any? Hey, you so glad you came by. Hello. Uh, I don't need to talk to you because you're Max. I just want your dress. Yep, let's go. Let's oh, go dig. We're gonna go dig some holes. We're about to have the same thing happen here. It was in the high 90s the last two days, but it's supposed to be cool tomorrow. It's been in the 80s here. It's supposed to thunderstorm its ass off tomorrow. I mean, it says it's still supposed to get up to 80 degrees, but it's supposed to start raining about 10 a.m. and then finish by two, which is nice because it'll be the entire time the kids are in school. So I won't have to worry about getting my hair wet. That's nice. Um, and then it's supposed to drop to the 60s and 70s for the rest of the week and into the weekend. So fingies cross for that. Okay, uh, I need clay. Clay is... Glade, Plateau, Forgotten Lands. Let's go to, um, let's go here. Because I could just go into the Forgotten Lands as well. Change of scenery. Alright, so, uh, I guess let's just go find a nice flat spot. This works. All right. And then I'd sit here and I hit the microphone and talk to you guys. You know? I just hold the button and she just goes. And then, you know, I'll turn around and hold the button again and close up all the holes because I hate how it bothered me so much. And I know Sturm knows this. I know he's probably going to laugh. It bothered me so much that he just left all of these holes everywhere. Like I, I like I watched him play, um, and there were just holes everywhere, and I just, I, it just, it, it drives me bonkers. It drove me absolutely bonkers. I was like, you have to, you have to like fill in your holes, okay? You, we're civilized here, or at least I am. My holes all have purpose, as I've said before. And yes, I know how it sounds. And I still stand by it. Hey, look, a memory. Give me that. Oh, good. More of Ariel's seashells. Okay, um... Let's do this one, then. Go. Why are you digging in that direction? That's not the direction I'm facing. I wish that I wish that there was something I could do to like increase other than making Minnie my bestie and hanging out with her because she does diggy stuff. I wish that there was like a food that I could eat that would like in Stardew Valley and and things like that. Like there are foods um, that you can do that you can do to like increase your fishing and it, things like that. Hey Matt, how's it going, bestie? How you doing? Stern fills your hole. Oh god, this is fatal. This is fatal. No. Oh, I totally read that wrong. You did Stern fill your holes, not Stern fills my holes. Got it. Both are accurate statements. But uh never mind. Never mind. Had late therapy and then got dinner. Yeah, I remember you telling me that you had therapy uh, this evening. How are you feeling, bestie? 
What's the... What do you... I mean, that's how you have three kids? This is very true. This is very true. They would not exist if Sturm did not fill my holes. Or at least one of them. Do a good can't complain? I'm glad to hear it. I'm glad to hear that you are doing good and cannot complain. You got crumble for dinner? Oh my god, I really need to like- I, I'm- I'm gonna need to get crumble. Why is it that every single time I stream, you guys start talking about food and all I want to do is eat, even though I've had dinner. I haven't had a treat. I didn't- I didn't have a dessert or anything. Um, but I was a good coin and I did eat my dinner. I ate all of my dinner. I ate all my salmon, all my veggies. I even had the biggest piece of salmon. I did. I did. Sorry, quit. I'm always hungry. I like foods. Me too. <laughs> Matt, when I eventually come up to meet you, we're just going to have like, I'm going to have to, I'm just going to have to like not eat anything for three days and then come up there and just binge eat all of the places around you, like the ice cream shop and crumble and you and I are going to cook things together, I'm sure. <laughs> I mean, biscuits with sausage and gravy and scrambled eggs. Oh, you had a Brenner night. Very nice. Very nice. That's what Bug asked me. He's like, I want Brenner for because he doesn't eat salmon. And so um, he's like, I want Brenner. I was like, you had Brenner last night because you told me you were too tired to eat what I made for dinner. Um, and so you were actually, no, I we were doing leftovers last night because uh, Sturm was working late to kind of catch up for being sick over the weekend. Um, and so I was like, you're not having Brenner two nights in a row. Especially, like, no, no, no. No, no, especially when, you know, you had breakfast this morning as well. Like, you need to eat something a little bit more substantial. So he had chicken nuggets and green beans. You got paid today? Ooh, you may go get a Jamolka. Very nice. I think I'm supposed to get paid tomorrow. And when, when I do, because I think Thursdays are every, every other Thursday, um... But when I get paid, I told myself uh, that I was going to do something nice for myself. So I just need to hold myself to that and and do something nice for me tomorrow. Can you? Can you? All right. Just. Oh, my God. It's fine. You guys just keep talking about like these gourmet cookie things. And I'm just like, God, I want, I want cookies. I want soft, chewy, dough-like Like, that was the thing that I really liked about Late Night D, which is part of the reason I really hate that they're, that they closed. Because their cookies, they were just, they were so soft and doughy. Like, they were fully cooked, but they tasted like you were just eating cookie dough. Because you can't convince me that cookie dough doesn't taste different than a, than a baked cookie. There, there is a distinct difference in the taste, and I will... I will stand by that, and I just, I, w I loved it. It was so good. Some of it was back pay because I put in hours late, and I but I brought myself a binder as a gift for myself. That's nice. I'm in the process of getting the supplies for Friday's work thing in which I'm making a couple kinds of cookies. Yeah, I know. You talked about the fact that you were going to make a whole bunch of cookies for a work thing on Friday, and I was like... I think that's how we got started on cookies yesterday because of all the chaos and we always talk about cookies. I did find out that there is apparently a crumble location nearby. I don't remember exactly how far it is for me, but like there is one that is close by. Making pumpkin spice cookies and double chocolate chip cookies. I need to make that pumpkin spice scone recipe that you sent me. Ooh, that's what I could do. Sturm, can I get one of the pumpkin spice scones out of the freezer? <laughs> It'll thaw and then I can eat it. Because I'm smart and I get I get six what's crumble? It's like a gourmet cookie chain. Um... I don't know. It, it's apparently like super popular and really good. I've never had it before, but I keep hearing people talk about it. But like gourmet, like they're expensive. Um, I think 80 or said that like a dozen is like 50 bucks. 
It said it was a dupe for those Starbucks ones, so I knew you needed it. I tried a, a dupe Starbucks one. Um, I think I was. I think it was when I was pregnant with Pumpkin. I tried it, and they turned out okay. They were good, but like they didn't freeze as well for me. They weren't as uh, like they weren't dry, but they weren't as. It wasn't quite the same consistency. It wasn't bad, but it wasn't quite the same. No thinking I'll make my own of my own cookies fifties for a dozen. Yeah. I mean that's you know, that's gourmet for you. Gourmet. Apparently they're going to be opening one near me sometime soon. Oh. Oh my. I only know it due to eight. Yeah, I was gonna say I've heard of it because uh, I've curved it because of eight, mainly because of Matt. And then uh, Ader, you said something about it the other night in stream too. Oh, I'm running out of energy. Oh no! Oh no! Hold on, I've got a bunch of stuff I can eat. Shove that in my face. Yeah, eat one more of those and then eat a berry salad. Give me the sticks. Give me all the sticks. Give me all the sticks. Hi, Ariel. Hello. I'm not here for you right now. I'm I'm digging holes. I'm 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 digging holes. Digging holes. Shove that in my face. Oh, jeez. Look. 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 I say things and you guys just take them completely out of context and run wild with it. And it's one of the reasons I love you, because it's funny. The pumpkin spice scones I'm making said that the store ones... Or that the store... Th uh, eh, said that the store th they work at... Wait. The store they work at makes these cookies and sells them six bucks for half a dozen. So I'm guessing they're pretty good. My god. Wow. Sure, give me dream shards. Might as well. Give, give, give points. Give, thank you. Uh, hmm. I should get more. Not now, coin. Not now. Don't get distracted. Hold on. What's my inventory like? It's fine. All right, we're going to go up here. We're going to go up into the new zone. It's dark and foreboding because it's forbidden. And there's all kinds of fire. I forgot about all the fire. Uh-oh. I forgot about the fire. Okay, the fire kind of makes things a bit difficult. Um, I also don't want to get lost. Ooh, six. Six. Whoa, what's this? What's that? Oh, it's ginger. Okay. Uh, light sticks. What the? Hello? Hello? Whoa! Whoa! <gasps> oh my god! I didn't need the well over here. I could act. <gasps> I did not know that. I did not know that. My mind is blown right now. I... Oh, okay. Okay. All right. I'm gonna need more tea. I didn't... I, di I didn't know that that ramp was there. I didn't... I didn't know. Thanks, Donald. I guess. Uh, I don't have any... Stuff to get. Wait, is there green passion lilies around? Isn't this where passion lilies are? Hold on. If I go find one, I'm gonna give it to you. Bye, Ariel. All right. Okay, Minnie, can I change you so that like you don't? No, I, I don't. I don't need to talk to you. Um. Yeah, how sweet. I'm. I'm a total bitch and berating you, but yes, I'm super sweet. I'm the. I'm the best ever. Um. Can I change it so that, like, you don't give me money? Can you just give me clay? 
Push her in the lake? Oh, but I wish that I could. Also, hi, Kipper. How you doing? All right. River, whatever. <laughs> There's a lake too, it's just on the other side, but yes, hi. For sure, the lake. <laughs> guys, if I could, all right, you guys have suggested that I set people on fire, Gothel, and now you've suggested that I push Minnie in a lake. I will not question you. She didn't get pushed in, she jumped. Yeah, there you go. See, me, Matt's got my back. Digging holes, filling holes. Look, I am not one of those heathens that just has holes everywhere. That would drive me absolutely bonkers. I can't do it. I just can't. If I'm going to dig the holes and I'm not going to plant something, I'm going to fill the hole. Modern nice soy, soy milk. Cool story, bro. Wait, what? Yeah, no, I just, I, I can't. I, I literally cannot. If if I dig the holes, they're going to have a purpose. And if I'm not putting seeds in them, I'm going to fill them. Because otherwise, it's going to drive me absolutely nuts. Look, Sturm's, Sturm's game gives me anxiety. It gives me anxiety, okay? Because he... Not only does he dig holes and then he leaves them. Because he doesn't like... Like, you literally just have to hold the button. You don't even have to do anything. You just have to hold the button, dig in a straight line, turn around, hold the button again, okay? Okay, calm down, Donald. I appreciate that you have some solidarity with me right now, but, like, this is, this is my time. And I feel like you're kind of making it all about you. Like, I feel like you're just kind of making it all about you. Oh, good. We're doing it again. Okay, cool. All right. Well, I'm going to move you out of the way so I can pick up my stuff. And you have fun with that. 46 already. We're doing great. Okay, bye, Donald. What the fuck is this problem? He tripped over himself and it makes him angry. He tripped over his big feet. Oh, all right. He's over it now. Bye, Donald. He's good. He's good now. A fucking facelift. Yeah. He, uh, he trips over his own feet and then gets mad. Sturm will just heckin leave the zone when he starts doing that because it's a it's a long animation. <laughs> uh, but yeah, so Sturm just like leaves all of these holes everywhere. And then not only that, then he goes and he does like mining runs and he'll just go and he'll only pick up the gems. So he walks around his island and there's just coal and rocks everywhere. Just, just everywhere. And it drives me nuts. He's got quackers. Ludi, I love you. <laughs> oh, jeez. I don't blame anyone for wanting to leave during that. Yep. 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 Uh, okay. I wish I could use this to teleport other places. I can! Hold on. Uh, well, let's go ahead and go down here then, because I think Blade of Trust I can get cool, or not cool, play from too. Look, we're almost a quarter of the way there, and that's just what's in my inventory. That's not even counting what I have in boxes. Give me the sticks. Wait. I'll well, just, uh... Alright. <laughs> He's got Quacker's Ugg. <laughs> Minnie, you're kind of in my way. Minnie, you're kind of in my way. Mini, you're still, you're, you're still, I don't want the coins. I, 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 I am coin. I don't need you to give me more money. Okay. I sell vegetables, ma'am. I don't need your handouts. I need clay. I find it easier to teleport straight from the map. I didn't know that I could though. So just, you know, the more, you know, but yeah, I also just find it easier to just teleport from the map. That's how I've been doing it. All right. I'm going to just. Do all this. Sometimes I can't help myself. It's okay. Sunlit Plateau is the only place I've ever found clay so far. So the collections tab does tell you where you're where you can find it. Um and it said Glade of Trust, Sunlit Plateau, and Forgotten Lands. So those three zones are supposed to give you clay when you dig. 
Which, I mean, makes sense. Swamp, savanna, and whatever the fuck kind of biome is going on in Forgotten Lands. It's just a whole heckin' mess over there. I do want to go fishing, though. I haven't gone fishing in so long. I'll go fishing. All right. I mean, we're doing pretty decently. I'm not, I'm not, I'm not mad. I'm not mad about this. We're almost halfway there. And that's just what's, again, that's just what's in my inventory. I wish I could get rid of the big mushrooms. I can get rid of the small mushrooms now. I can't get rid of the big ones. Not yet. Minnie, I don't need your money. I don't need the handouts. This, this isn't what this is for. I just want the clay. Okay, Bond Coinby. What? The Forgotten Lands is thick woods with two seeds. That is not it. That is not inaccurate, Nice. That is not inaccurate. Not at all inaccurate. Can I? All right, I just. Let's just dig. Ooh. I'm just gonna go. Bon Con Jovi better. No, none of that is good, Fatal. None of it is good. None of it is good. All right, let me get Stream Raiders going. Oh my god. Oh. That's soil. That's not. Whatever. Coin Bon Jovi, God fucking damn it, fingers. That sounds a little bit better, but why are we calling me? Why are we calling me Bon Jovi? Because I'm doing halfway. Because I'm doing living on. You're, are you doing living on a prayer? Is is that where we're going with this? Halfway. That, yep. Oh jeez. Okay. Eat another one. And then we're gonna eat another one of these. And fuck it, we're gonna eat a fish sandwich too. All right, go pick up all of our goodies. Never mind, they stopped being blue. Even shit there. All right. And now we fill. Oh, oh good, victory, victory. No, all right. Hey. Why do you hesitate? It drives me nuts. All right, victory, Melodia, Wiggyol, and Fatal. Congrats on your rewards. Boop, boop, boop. Let's do that one next. It's probably one of the most painstaking quests in the game. <laughs> hey, sixty-nine. Nice. Yeah, I, I mean, like all the level ten ones seem to be like this. Um. So. Uh, all the level 10 ones seem to have like a big quest like this. So I I get it, but at the same time, like, oh god. I'm just gonna don't even bother here because there's just just, just don't bother. Just don't. Um hold on, I'm setting battle plans for uh stream raiders real quick. Oh, no, I didn't mean to do that. Nope, I didn't mean to do that. Do th no, stop. Go to the vibe one. I said vibe. I guess I could put you guys here, too. That's fine. But, like, you can't go through there. Okay, there we go. Much easier if they're level 10 quests. They're much easier level 10 quests. This one is just try. That's fair. That's fair. Honestly, I feel of the level 10 rewards, like the ones that I want the most, I really want Ariel's because I love the dress. I really want Ursula's because I want the dress. I want Minnie's because I want the dress. And I want to do Moana's too because I want the dress. I don't really give a shit about Goofy's hat. Like, I just, I just don't. I just don't. Chores back in. Okay, Kipper, enjoy your lurk as much as you can because, you know, chores. Collecting some quests for stream raiders. 
Ugh. Man, I'm loving this game, but I, I, I can't lie. I'm super pumped for October and finally being able to start scary games. I'm so excited that I finally get to play Mortuary Assistant. I can't wait to check out As Dusk, Dusk Falls, The Quarry, like all these games that I've been avoiding like the plague to try and avoid spoilers. And I finally get to play them. And then after after Scary Month is over, after October's over, then we're hit, hitting the ground running with, with Stack Up. And I'm just, I'm super excited. I can't wait. Because we, I mean, I had so much fun when we did Stack Up last year. And I feel really, really good about the incentives and the milestones. I hope that they're going to be fun. I hope they're going to be entertaining. And I mean, at the very least, I'm going to have a lot of, it's going to be a lot of fun content with you guys. Quit needs to look into metaphysical. It looks so good. What is metaphysical? Is that a game? Drop it in game suggestions for Moose is Fatal. I thought the bot said, fuck your lurk. <laughs> like, get your ass back here. Fuck your lurk. I was both confused and a little wet. Oh my, Fatal. Oh my. Oh my. Okay, can I... Alright, so we're almost... Okay, we're at 80... 80... Oh, let's just... Let's just go... Let's just... Yeah, let's just dig here. Oh. Go here. Yeah. Have you heard of prognostic before? I think that I, I feel like that sounds familiar. Play forgive me, father. Hi, Johnny. Why? Look, if you guys have suggestions, please feel free to drop them in the Discord in the suggestions. I will look at them because I've got um, I've got one-off spots. I pro probably in October, and then depending on how things go in November, you guys know I'm always looking for things that you guys want to see. Um, and it's always good to have games in my back pocket in case, like, technical difficulties and shit doesn't work out, or I finish games faster than I think I will, or something. Remember to drop suggestions in the game suggest- yep, 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 yep. I feel like I have heard of a prognostic before. I might even have that. That sounds very familiar now that you mention it. I don't know why it sounds familiar. I've probably seen somebody, like, that somebody was playing it. No, I didn't mean to... Stop it! Stop it! Stop it! We have to fill the other holes! Stop it! Stop. Mm. There must be cleaning. It smells like bleach. Ugh. Keep going. But I mean, we also have, you know, in November, one of the in one of the milestones is it is a uh, slick slick poo the clown because it's for charity. I'll do it. Okay, but like I want you guys to hit these goals, but I also don't want you guys to hit these goals. Is a Sarah Bear? Hi, hon. How you doing? How are you? I may have to go do another tea break. Let's go get like more tea. Can you can you finish, please? All right, ninety-two. This is actually going a lot better than I thought. Sir made it sound like I would literally be doing this all stream. Sarah's heckin' dead. Oh, oh no, have you had a long day? I'm sorry. Well, come vibe. Come relax and just vibe and just exist. And let my bad, horrible gameplay give you laughs. I put in the suggestions now, but if you love Supernatural, the show, and Phasmophobia or Ghost Exorcism, this game is for you. Yeah, that sounds right up my alley. That, that sounds right up my alley. Long three days? Oh, I'm so sorry. Do you want to share what you've been... What, like, is it just, like, work-related? Is it personal life? Like, you don't have to share, but, like... 
as long as there's no like serious kind of content you can feel free to unload a little bit i need oh 98 98 work oh have they been working you really hard saber i'm sorry i've been really busy too but i really like my job so it's easier right now <laughs> Okay, we're halfway there. We got a hundred. Oh, these my butt looks good in these jeans. I know it's pixels, but my butt looks good in these jeans. Right, let's go pick up all our rewards. I wonder what I would do if I just like, I just, I, I dug all of these holes and then just decided, you know what? I am going to plant things. I'm just going to have random crops all over the place. Hey, Willie, we're doing fine. Well, okay. I can't speak for chat. I'm doing fine. I'm doing okay. How are you doing, Willie? How's it hanging? We're just talking about the next, uh, next step in content so you know what we're doing for october and then preparing for stack up and all that and just i'm super excited for stack up super duper excited because i just so um if you guys remember uh when we did our last charity stream which was the world wildlife fund for earth hour and we had like the stickers and 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 things and i got like the shadow box for it um so what i'm gonna do for i think it's ten dollars i think it's the ten ten dollars and up so every donation for stack up ten dollars and up um i'm gonna do origami so what i'm gonna do is i got I, i'm gonna get like a book of origami uh paper and like thanks potato I'm going to do um, like orig like origami. Um, and so what I'm going to do is I'll take the origami paper and write the names on the paper and then make a little animal. And then what I'll do at the end of it is I'll get a big shadow box and put all of the origami things in there as like a commemorative piece that I can put in my background eventually. Uh, nobody had an incident at work and I work at an armed security guard. So you can imagine I'm stressed. Oh, I'm so sorry, Sarah Bear. I hope that you can find a way to relax and kind of chill out. Um, apparently crops go quicker in their own biomes. Huh. I haven't tested that. I will definitely, I, I definitely don't know. I have not tested that. I haven't really grown anything outside of, um, my own personal garden. All right. We're at 103. Which, I mean, not bad. Because we've only been playing the game for not, we haven't been playing the game for that long. Mostly it's just, I've been able to just talk. Doing well, thanks for asking. Just watching some shows and hanging in streams is a good life. It is a good life. It is a good life. I'm glad to, to have you hanging out with us for a little bit, Willie. I really appreciate it. What shows are you watching? I just started, so I just started watching, um, like literally just before stream while I was cooking and eating dinner, I started watching, there is this, um, the show, I think it's a Hulu original, but like on Hulu called Maggie and it's about a psychic and um, she sees her like she sees a future with herself in it and gets the impression that like this is the guy she's supposed to marry and have kids with and like that's never happened before. She's ever seen her own future. And then so like she runs into the guy and winds up like sleeping with him, but then she goes to tell him about her vision and she has another vision and sees him like marrying another woman. And she's like, wait a minute, did I just like miss miss see everything? So she like she pushes him away and then and now they're like running into each other and it's 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 kinda of, it's I don't know, it's funny. But I'm giving it a shot. But it's called Maggie. Currently watching Supernatural. Good show. Good show. Good choice. Good choice. Decent. Solid. Ugh. 
Yeah, I'm definitely gonna need more tea. I'm gonna need another. I'm gonna need tea to break a tea break. Has it all gone now? I love my BB-8 mug. I love my big mugs. Big mugs are the best. Big mugs are go home. I probably need to finish Supernatural, but I feel like at this point I need to restart at some point because I don't remember everything that was happening, but I don't know where I'd restart from. I feel like restarting from the very beginning is just too much but I don't know where I'd restart from. But I think I was in, I think I was in like season 11. Do I have a favorite pet so far? Um, I don't have that many. I've been running around with uh, with Richmond, which is what I call my little Choco dude. Where is he? Did I put him away? He should be around here, I don't know, hold on. But I apparently, um, I, I have Pua. And I tried to put on... Oh, there he is. Okay, yeah. There he is. Um, yeah, so I don't have that memory. I had the Increda Squirrel. I've got Choco Crocodile. I've got Classic Squirrel. And I've got Pula. I have Pula run around with me. I really want the Regal Fox, but I don't want to... I don't want to... I don't want to buy the game. <laughs> like, I'm playing it for free on, on, uh, on Game Pass right now. And, like, I don't want to pay for the full game just so I can have the regal fox but my god is it cute it's a little fox and it's got like a crown and a little cape it's so cute but I guess you, I think you have to get like the ultimate or deluxe edition or something like that to get it and I was just like that's just not enough I'm not gonna pay 60 bucks just so I can have a, a vanity pet I have Pua following me and he's so precious I love Pua I love him he's so great I mean, I would also love Hey Hey, but I'll take Pua. It was scary and a bit traumatic despite having tens of hours of training for these situations from my time in industry and my Navy time, but that's all I'm seeing here. If you need to talk more, we do have the mental health section in the Discord, Sarah Bear, uh, that you are more than welcome to share stuff in. I'm sorry that, that that happened and that you had a traumatic experience. I really am sorry to hear that. Hey, hey would be so great especially if he just like periodically stops and screams i mean that would probably get real annoying real fast but um it would be really cute for a bit i restarted i had only seen the first half of most on season 12 maximum effort there you go yeah i think i had seen the first uh 11 or 12 seasons because sturm and i were watching it together for a bit um I remember when I first started the show, I I had thought that it was going to be very different than it was. Like I thought it was, um, I didn't think that it was fiction or I didn't think that it was going to be fictional in the way that it was. Um, and then I was just kind of hooked because Jensen Ackles really does it for me. Like really does it for me. I just like, I just can't with Jared because I, I knew him from Gilmore Girls. And it really weirded me out that in Gilmore Girls, his name was Dean. But in Supernatural, there was a Dean and it wasn't him. And it just, it really fucked with me. And I can't, like, I just, I just, I just like, mm, mm. All right, um, let's go dig somewhere else. Let's get all the sticks that we need Okay, um... Alright, where's that place that Donald was? Oh wait, no, I teleported here, that's right, shit. I teleported here. Um... So it's really just this side of the map. Entirely this side of the map. Okay, uh... Oh. Let's just teleport here then. Hey Nemo, how's it going? Welcome in, how are you feeling today? Oh, unicorn cuddles, I got you, I got you. Sir, 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 come here, there you go. She is, <gasps> A good cuddle is always great for self-care. 
Okay, don't, don't, don't tear off my headphones, sir. Be gone, Burb. I don't have any sugar cane to give you. I still have not tried that. I still have not tried that theory yet. Still haven't tried it yet. I need to. Still haven't. Well, that's not the direction I meant to go in, but okay. Like, I understand everything's on a grid, but I'm also like, man, can I just... Can I just pick a line and go? Sticks, don't get distracted, coin. Fill the holes, fill the holes, fill the holes. Would you like me to tell you what they like? Is it sugar cane? If it's not, don't tell me. But if it is, tell me. Because they look very much like hummingbirds. And so Serum was saying maybe it might be sugar cane. I was like, oh, that makes sense. But I haven't tried it yet. I haven't really tried to feed any of the animals. I just know that the squirrels like, um, I know the squirrels like apples because I gave one an apple and it got really, really excited. And now it's my friend. I feel like the last half of it's going to take forever. Thirty-five! Heck yeah! Ooh, oh, okay, this is the, uh, okay. That's the, the jacket that Sturm has. Some adults have two favorite foods, surprisingly enough. Oh, really? Interesting. I was just stuck on thinking, like, all of, that all of it had to be plants, and so I was like, what the fuck kind of plants a crocodile gonna eat? Mm -mm. They're probably gonna eat fishes. Because there's not really any other meat source. Just fish. Because, like, foxes and crocodiles are probably going to have, like, fish rather than fruits and vegetables. Um, and I have no idea what the hell I'd give a raccoon. Right. Oh. One twenty-three. I haven't even picked up everything yet. Hold on, let me just give, give. No, give, give me this one. All right, one twenty-eight. Okay, okay. We can do this. We can do this. We can do this. Minnie, I'm gonna get your dress. I'm gonna do it. And then I'm gonna have to do this all over again, probably off stream. <laughs> So that I can replenish clay. Although I have no idea what I need clay for. Chappy hold cookies. I want cookies. Where? I want cookies. So jealous of fucking cookies. What? You're making me look on DoorDash for cookies. Desserts. Where can I order from? McDonald's? No. Safeway? No. Wawa? No. None of these are what I'm looking for. Okay, I can't get cookies. Alright, well, I can't get cookies. It's, uh, it's not in the car. It's not in the car, guys. It's not in the car. Oh, you don't need DoorDash? Come here, lady. I got you. Blake, you're, like, halfway across the country. I can't, um... Oatmeal raisin, ugh, choco chip, double chocolate. Oh, the last three sound good. I don't really like oatmeal raisin. I like oatmeal, but I just don't like oatmeal raisin. The only raisins I like are raisins or chocolate covered raisins. Imagine if they made raccoons favorite food biscuits in reference to Pocahontas. That would be funny. That would be very funny. Although I don't think the biscuit. I don't. Can we? We can't make biscuits. I mean, they're cookies, but. English call them biscuits and we can make like we can make beignets and I know we can make chocolate chip cookies I don't think we can make like biscuits though cake maybe cookie Oof. <laughs> I had death by chocolate cake not worth it uh that sounds completely worth it added too much chocolate don't wait double chocolate ended up being death by chocolate and still soft gooey and melty 
flight I hate you because that sounds delicious. I love chocolate. I love death by chocolate. You can see all the possibilities in the middle. Yeah, yeah. I don't remember seeing a biscuits. I like I know how to make beignet. I've I've discovered the recipe for beignets. I don't remember seeing biscuits, but I can look again. Mm. I just want like a sweet now. I wish I had had the foresight to take out um to take out that Carlos bakery cake and like cut a slice so that I could um have it after stream because ooh, I would kill that. I would kill that. Bangies. I have so many ideas for like cooking streams that I'd love to do. I do know that um for cuz one of the incentives for stack up the $100 like if you donate $100 um I will make and send you like homemade cookies uh, for the holidays. Um, and if I can get them to do it, I'll do a homemade card from the kiddos as well. But I would love to stream that, like stream, just have like a cookie baking stream. Um, I think that would be a lot of fun. I'd also, I think there also is one of the rede one of the milestones is a, to do a donate now. The link is active right now, so people could donate. Um, but I don't think I'm going to be honoring incentives until November. Donate cookies. <laughs> no, don't donate cookies. You would donate, it would be $100 and I would uh, do a tin. I may have to limit those because I don't know how much it's going to cost me to ship all of those, depending on where they have to go. But I'm not sure. Give Johnny cookies in November. Donate $100, Johnny. Donate to, uh, donate to Stack Up. And I will gladly do that. Hmm. Do the, the beignets recipe include chocolate? I haven't locked unlocked it, but now I'm thinking wheat, chocolate, sugar cane, eggs, and milk. Uh, we can look. Because uh, I don't remember. No, it's just four things. It's just four things. There's no chocolate in there. Yeah. <clears throat> it's um it's canola oil instead of milk. It's wheat, sugarcane, eggs, and canola oil. Or canola. Don't donate wor donate worry coin I got you, or at least the monies to I get from Blight and ADR I got you. <laughs> it was close, thank you, no problem. Gotta put kiddo to bed. I hope that she goes down easy for you, Melodia. Yeah, I mean, um because we've got what we've got the sticker the sticker set we've got the um the pin set and then we've got the personalized thank yous and the uh well the personalized thank yous are, are going to be unlimited so that's going to be um probably cumulative but i'm thinking that the uh the cookie packs are probably either going to be limited and the, like so if they are limited there those are not going to be uh cumulative so you'd have to donate that specific amount for that thing um, you made a, f a flow field? What's a flow field? What's that? What's that? <clears throat> oh, jeez. Why can't I just go in a straight line? Because I'm not straight. Uh -huh. Shit! Made a... F <laughs> it's a field that flows? Light, I don't need your sass! Look, you. Look, you already, you've done enough damage. I'm not afraid of you anymore. You already have what you wanted. Vulcan. Cause lines being straight is so hard. <laughs> it really is. Hey Vulcan, I will get to the stretch in just a second. Let me, let me close up these holes. Hey, don't yell at blue. What are you gonna do, Adir? What are you gonna do? What are you gonna do? Like do it, Sass. He's not Minnie. <laughs> it's true, I do yell at Minnie a lot. Look, she injects in conversations where she does not belong. I'm a charge in my sasser. What are you gonna do, Blight? You've got the emo. There's literally nothing more you can do. There's nothing more you can do. There's nothing more after that. It's just, it's just, it's there. How you doing, Vulcan? Right, you, Blight uses sass. It's super, it's super unaffected. Or it's not, it's not very effective. There you go. You gonna judge me with my own emote, Blight? You gonna judge me with my own emote? Is that what you're gonna do right now? 
But we had a talk with the seven-year-old spirits. Wait, about spirits? His this parenting thing is overrated. What do you, what do you mean? Like you had a talk with them about spirits? Like they're seeing spirits? Yeah, Koi, there isn't anything yet. Look, if uh, if they're being hello, if they're being something encourages y'all to do more chaos, then maybe there never will be. Maybe there never will be. Here's like drinks. Yeah, I was gonna say like drinks are like ghosts. <laughs> the house is all settled down, so I'm gonna play some green light as well. Ooh, I love it, Vulcan. I love it. I love it. How far are you? Who like how many people have you unlocked and who's your favorite companion so far and why is it Wally? I mean we'll just see continue to Kayla. There's no point to continuing the chaos, so there's no end goal. There's nothing for you to achieve. Also, I was looking at my statistics um, for my emotes outside of the channel. Do you guys want to guess how many times that spicy emote has been used since Blight unlocked it yesterday? You want to know? You want to know? You want to anyone want to hazard a guess how many times it's been used? She says her toys move and talk at night. Oh, shit, son. The angle is making sure Quinn is happy. Quinn is over 100. 69 times more 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 wait blake you why doesn't it work not 420 not quite 420 it was like 250 like 200 like 240 250 something like that blake why is your Wait, why, why, why is Queen at Spicy not working? Wait, what? Why isn't it working anymore? Wait, what? Wait, what? I'm so confused. Why is it showing up as text? Uh-oh, why is my bitrate dropping? Bitrate, hello? Am I good? Uh-oh. Bitrate, good. Get dropped. Because the lowercase L looks like it. You son of a bitch, Blight. <laughs> Quaid took it away from Blute. I didn't. <laughs> I did not. <laughs> Blight was trolling me. Blight, how dare. Blight, I'm going to put you in the... I'm going to put you in the no-no corner. I'm going to put you in the poop corner. Those six nice outhouses in the cult, you don't get to use a single one of them. You have to go in the poop corner. <laughs> I please. <laughs> All right, last few seconds to get those units in. For stream raiders, 150. We're almost there. The battle is ready. All right. Uh, there we go. Start battle. But it will break. It will break you out of the poop corner. Not, no, Johnny, you will not. You will not do that. That is a thing that you will not do. Blight has caused enough chaos. So has Adir, actually. All of you have caused enough chaos. Oh, that must be Ariel. I was like, who the, what the fuck am I here? I didn't. Do oh, I am so angry at myself. You guys distracted me. I didn't cover up these holes. Oh my god, I'm a heathen. Oh my god, I'm a heathen! But we good noodles? Looney, you're a good noodle. You're a good noodle. Those ones over there, those Chaos Brothers, they're... They're naughty noodles. Also, Looney and JB, congrats on your rewards. Let's go with this one. I don't cause chaos, I just encourage it. You and Mel Melodia does enough of that. I'll do it with a secret tunnel, secret tunnel. There's no secret tunnels in my cult. I am the cult leader. I would know if there's a secret tunnel. If you guys are building secret tunnels without me, I'm going to put you in the stocks. Look, Fatal learned his lesson. Fatal's a good boy now. He learned his lesson. Um, put it here. All right, hold on. Unit planning. Boop. We're gonna put it. There. Put it there, and here is okay as well. Um, we're gonna put this here. Uh, 
Hey, today's Wednesday. Cool. Did I complete any quests? No, I didn't. Okay. Why is my bitrate dropping? Is my stream okay? Are you guys getting buffer? Because my bit, like every time I look at it now, my bitrate has dropped down to the red. Or is it just OBS being a piece of shit again? Like it sometimes does. Sure, it was okay? Okay. Like now it's fine. But like every once in a while, like I, this is the second time I've looked over at it. Like I look away from it and then I look over at it and it's down in the red. No pineapples here. Still watching coin work them holes. Oh, thanks. Perfect. Oh. Oh, bang. <laughs> you guys can't use bangs to bribe fatal. That's unfair. I can't compare to bangs. I can't. I cannot compare to bangs. I forgot a bush. Shit. Mr. Fatal Bang, no! Stop making Mr. Fatal Bang! Stop giving him bangs! Mrs. Fatal provide bang to... <laughs> I'm on coin side, there we go, see? Fatal can't be shaken. Fatal can't be shaken. Fatal knows where his loyalties lie. You have been flaunted, Chaos Brothers. Can I pick that up now? Yes, I can. I thought we were talking about a different kind of bowl for a second. Wait, what bowl? Wait, what? Bowl? He may not be able to be shaken, but he can possibly be stirred. <laughs> God damn it, Eater. <laughs> Alright, my goal is to finish this. This, uh, to get all the clay by 10. I get 15. I get 18 minutes. Eighteen minutes. Or chat's gonna leave me. No, you're not. Well, if you do, it's fine. Like, I'll, I'll live. I'll survive. Hello. I wasn't trying to talk to you. We're not talking right now. We're not talking right now. I'm picking up sticks. Yeah, it's how sweet. I'm picking up sticks. I'm not talking to you right now. Picking up sticks, digging holes. You may not be... Uh, oh, that was... Oh, yep, it was Johnny. It wasn't Adi. Are you right? Sorry, Johnny. Sorry. Uh, no, that was a response to Punk. But I do the reply part for some reason. <laughs> but it did the reply part for some reason. That's weird. I thought the lake was on fire for a second. I need to do fishing in here. I need to do some heckin' fishing. Go hang out with Donald. Because Donald's one of my... I think I made Donald fishing. Maybe I didn't. I don't remember, honestly. I love that I can just walk in fire and it's not an issue. Okay. Ooh. More sticks. Because I also need hardwood. I'm going to need to gather hardwood. And iron. My god, I gotta go mining. I gotta go on mining runs and get iron. So I can make more iron ingots. Because I don't have enough. I don't have 30. Why I be summoned? Because they're trying to turn you against me, Fatal. They're trying to turn you against me. So they're summoning you to shake and stir you. Oh, well, that's probably one of the reasons I'm getting so much. I'm picking up three every single time. Is that because... Actually, no, Minnie's my only digging buddy. Wow, Minnie finds a lot of shit. I got 106 stuff. We ain't doing too bad. We ain't doing too shabby. I want more tea. I want more tea. I'm sad that my tea is gone. And that it takes time to make tea. Burb? Yes, burb. There's burb. There is burb. I need to go grab some sugar cane and see if that works. <laughs> why are we ha why are we honking at me? Why are we honking in my general direction? Coin is good coin. Coin is best coin. Hmm. Oh. Okay, I need 33 more. 
33. I want to get all the foxes off. Like, I will get all of the pets. But I want to get, like, all the foxes. The foxes are so cute. Had to have a religion and ghost monster talk with the oldest. Yeah, uh, Punk was just saying that um, your your child was your seven year old was saying that uh, their toys move and talk at night. Hi, Jackie Coyne. I love you. I'm gonna go. I know. I know. I saw you streaming earlier, and I'm sorry I couldn't stop in. I had uh, technical difficulties. It's a raid. Oh. Oh. Oh, I see. I love you and I'm going to bed and then you're raiding me. I see. I see. We're raiding stuff. Okay, we raiding stuff. Okay. 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 We not cleaning stuff no more. We raiding stuff. Okay. Well, hi. Hello, raiders. Hi. Hello. <laughs> hi, Jackie. I love you. Bye, Jackie. Go bed. Go bed. I love you. Go bed. Serve part of the raid? Probably. Oh, actually, no. He's, um, I think he's doing stuff upstairs. Normally, he's not here on Wednesdays. Oh, wait. Storm is part... Yeah, that doesn't... Yeah, that makes sense to me. Storm would be part of the raid. Um, What was Jackie playing? What was Jackie doing? I know Jackie's... I know I know Jackie's go bed, but, like, what was Jackie doing? Guys, if you're not following Jackie, Jackie's amazing. Um, If you were here Saturday, we did our collab We Clean stuff uh, with Jackie, which is a fucking delight every single time. Oh, Jackie was doing a cult. Okay, Jackie, Jackie was doing cult. Um... Jackie was colting. Jackie was cult leading. Okay, Jackie, I hope that I hope that colting was good. Um Hi, hello everybody. If you don't know who I am, I'm Coin, I'm a variety streamer. Um I play things like Cult of Lamb. I'm also um Jackie and I have done We Clean Stuff Power Wash Them collabs recently, and it's a whole heck of a lot of fun. We are big on self-care, mental health, um, positivity, LGBTQIA2 plus safe space, all that stuff. Um and right now we're playing some Dreamlight Valley. Uh talking about all kinds of random shit but we have some scary games coming up in october and then we also have a big charity event in november for a mental health organization called stack up that i work for um just a whole bunch of cool stuff so if you'd like to hang out and uh if you're not following if you want to hang out and see if we fit your vibe and then drop a follow if you like it feel free to do that if you need to go take care of yourself or go veg because it's late if you need to go bio get a snack do whatever you need to do please feel free to do that if you need to raid and run that's totally fine Appreciate you coming in on the raid and supporting our good friend Jackie. I still lurk. I just happen to come back before the raid. No problem. <laughs> no problem, Kiffer. Go enjoy your raid. All right, not your raid. Uh, go enjoy your uh, your lurk. Oh, ooh, sticks. Sticks. So right now, right now, I am um, I'm picking up sticks when I see them, but. But I am also digging a lot of holes. I am digging so many holes because I am trying to get... Ooh, hello. Because I am trying to get 200 clay. And when I started this, I had zero. I now have 172. So we're getting near to the end. We need 28 more. How's everyone been self-caring today? I took a nap. I took a nap. And um, I had a French loaf. One of my French loaves that was in the freezer. I had that. Um, but yeah, that, that's, that's pretty much how my self-care went today. Um, I didn't really get to do too awful much. It was kind of like, it's just been kind of busy. Uh, doing a lot of catch up, um, because I was trying to help support Sturm, uh, who was sick over the weekend. And so like Monday and Tuesday, I took a uh, squeaker to school as well as dropping bu a bug off at the bus. And then like literally from the moment I got up to the moment I got home, I was uh, just kind of all over the place and busy trying to work. Um, but yesterday I did stop at Starbucks on my way home and got myself a, um, a coffee and six pumpkin scones, which is awesome self care for me. Got candles from Target. Ooh, very nice. Very nice. Ketchup, what about mustard? <laughs> I do love... I actually like to... Okay, I know that this is kind of random, and but like um, when I do like ketchup, I put a mountain of ketchup and then I'll take mustard and like swirl it on top of it. And then I like dip my stuff in both so I get a nice mixture of mustard and ketchup. Generally, I prefer yellow mustard. I know that you didn't ask, but I'm just sharing. Generally, I prefer yellow mustard. Um, 
but I will do like honey mustard for like chicken tendies and stuff like that. Mustard is gross. I used to think that. I wasn't a huge fan of it, but now I kind of like it sometimes. My self-care will be on Friday. I get to go to my doctor and find out what my uterus hormone is. I really, I'm really sending you like all kinds of positive vibes for that, Mrs. Fatal, because I know that you've been having a lot of issues with it and struggling with it. So I really hope that you get the answers that you're looking for and that, you, you know, there's a solution on the horizon for you, because I can't imagine like the shit that you've talked about that you go through. Blight. Blight, I'm going to need you to stop trying to debate me right now, okay? I'm going to need you to stop trying to debate me. Yeah, I know your tricks now. I know your trick now. You can't, you can't, it doesn't work. It doesn't do anything. I hate all the lies we were told as children about religion and made up fictional characters, but we're told to believe in spirits and ghosts. We're silly. It makes me sad to know that today people still lie to their kids like that. Wait, why? Wait, what? Wait, who's, li who's lying to their kid about that? That's okay, I still got to derp. She knows one trick. Oh, light. Yeah, yeah, no, it, it doesn't work for, for Adir. Adir hasn't, um, hasn't reached the number of bits required. Not that he has to. Wait, what happened to it? No, Blight's trolling. Blight's trolling. He's using an, a, a lowercase l instead of an uppercase i in spicy. He's trolling. He still has it. It doesn't just disappear. It doesn't work like that. He's just trolling. My oldest thinks ghosts are fake and that daddy's being silly and thinking ghosts are real. I mean, I will say this. It is definitely a... An issue, a, a topic that certain people don't think or don't believe in and then others do. I am on the on the uh, the side of it where I think that it's totally plausible. Um, I like religion and stuff aside, because I'm not very religious. I don't I, I would like to think I, I think that it's comforting to think that there's a, that there's life after this and that it, there's a higher power. But it's just not for me. I just don't believe it. It doesn't. It my brain can't my brain can't can't wrap itself around that concept it just does not work for me it doesn't make sense for me so i don't believe it i used to when i was younger um but i don't anymore when it comes to ghosts i can totally find it plausible that the because like when we die and our bodies decompose and even even not just us but like animals and stuff plants when they die and their matter decomposes it goes back to the earth well there are electrical impulses that make up our brains right that make us function and make our bodies function like our heart that energy doesn't just disappear like that that's that's a law of science that energy doesn't just disappear and so i can totally get behind the idea that especially for like someone that lived a traumatic life or had a traumatic death that their energy would still manifest in some other way and that could be a spirit now there's different types of spirits different types of haunting there's intellectual there's residual and then there's demonic and things like that and so it there, there i just i am a firm believer that ghosts are plausible um so I'm I'm firmly on board, but I also like I, I can also respect that some people are like, no, I don't believe in that. But I think it's plausible. I'm in the middle of unpacking all the religious shit in therapy. Ugh. We don't go to church or pray, but we still coexist with people that do believe. Mm. Yeah, and, and that's like it's I feel like there is so much that's changing in the current just just in like in the current oh we did it 200 in um in just like society currently with the current generations and everything that are being brought up um you're seeing shifts in a lot of paradigms that have been set up like more acceptance of lgbtqi2 plus identities you're seeing more people embrace those things neurodiversity mental health and accepting it 
There's just, there's so much more. Like, we're definitely taking step backwards, Roe v. Wade. We are taking step backwards, but we're also making giant leaps forward. So I feel like, I feel like a lot of religion or at least like old style religion that's like super strict and not accepting of other things because there are definitely people that are of a religious faith that are one extreme where they hate everything that isn't heterosexual and then there are others that are also part of the same faiths or different faiths and they are open and loving and accepting of all things neurodiversity and uh different sexualities so it's just it's I feel like there's a lot of change on the horizon and I really want us to get there, you know? I don't personally believe in ghosts, but that's due to growing up next to a cemetery. Wait, uh, I'm sorry, let me... That's valid. We're not religious, but my oldest thinks she's a witch, but tells me she thinks God is real also, so I let her know that witches believe in different higher power, and when I explained it to her, she lit up so too much. Oh, okay. I did a little bit of Wiccan when, um when I was in like high school and college because I was trying, I was going through like religious issues. I, I was Christian, I was baptized Lutheran um, and then a lot of stuff happened to me and I started questioning a lot of things. So I was looking for other answers and I try, I, I did uh, a little bit of like exploration with Wicca and witchcraft for a bit. Um, and yeah, it's, you know, it's it's definitely different um they, like there is still existence of higher power kind of thing but yeah it's definitely different um than traditional like god as a wiccan i can tell you there are lots of witches that also believe in jesus i'm not one of those i'm sure that there are so many different there are so many different religion religions that it's just like a hodgepodge of all kinds of stuff you know uh i as a christian still love my wife even though we have different religions because the bible says love thy neighbor and that's fair and that's wonderful you know believe what you believe but just don't your belief should not impact or harm other people i know for sure that there is evidence that jesus the person was real the son of god stuff is debatable oh yeah i'm i'm i, I was gonna say there there are documentaries about like the tomb of jesus and all that stuff um i'm sure that there is at least a person or maybe multiple people that Jesus in the Bible is at least based around. But we also have to keep in mind, like a lot of the, the hardcore people that are like, oh, we gotta follow the rules and everything, the Bible says this, like some of the interpretations are just like, you realize that this, this book was supposedly written by men, men, um, from, thousands and thousands of, of years ago right like this is like like shit's changed we've learned things and so maybe maybe taking it so literally is not the the, the, the best idea anymore you know like, like i don't know about that and heavily edited by the church and yeah that's true too and there are certain books like didn't mary magdalene write one but like hers wasn't included because she was a woman and also wasn't and you know all the rumors about her and all that shit. i was baptized either lutheran or e i don't remember what my mom told me but she didn't force it on me yeah my my dad took me to church because one of the various women that he paraded throughout my life um was super crazy and super religious and so we went to church all the time while he was with her um so there was that and i believe i was bad I, I remember i remember being baptized because i was actually wearing a, a, a little mermaid bathing suit underneath one of my dad's t-shirts when i got baptized i remember like i because i remember walking down the stairs and holding my nose and getting dunked under um I don't want anything to be forced on my oldest and I want her to explore religion, but I also let her know that she isn't allowed to force what she believes on us. And that's fair. And that's fair. Well, Sturm and I would love to have, like, in a perfect world, we would love to have copies of, like, all major religious texts so that if and when either of our, any of our children comes to us and is starting to question things, we can be like, you know, this is, this is how we see it. But, like, 
you know, that that's that is a personal journey that you need to go on. And while we will try our best to be supportive and answer your question or while we'll try our best to answer your questions and we will be supportive of whatever it is that you decide is right for you. Like we are not going to tell you what to believe. Because I feel like when it comes to religion or anything spiritual, really, that's that's so personal. And I don't feel like it should be forced upon any. Like, a lot of people argue that, like, it's all about moral morals and stuff like that. And it's like, I'm sorry, but you can understand right from wrong and not have it be about religion. Especially because a lot of shit in a lot of, like, super extremist religions are not right and wrong. I was taken to Sunday school as a young child, but when I got older, I participated in youth groups to socialize, but they were kind of toxic. So, yeah. um, I dated a guy uh, from my youth group that my dad, uh, my dad took me to a church um, and I met people and I, I, I had made friends there. And there was a guy that was in the youth group um, that was friends with my stepmother's son. And that's how I met him. And we started talking and we were getting to know each other. And uh, then shortly after we like dating, because this was like middle school, um, his dad died and a lot of shit changed. Um, I mean, understandably, that is a very, very traumatic thing. His dad, like it, it was very sudden. Um, his dad had a, had a heart issue and he passed and it was really hard on him and his mom. And he was suddenly shoved into this new role of like kind of taking on being um, the man of the house and and that whole mentality and everything. So it was it was a lot. And he became very abusive in our relationship. Um, and it was it was just it was just a bad a bad situation all around. Um, but. Because of that, because of that, um, a lot of, like, that impacted me a lot. And, like, that was one of the things that made me start questioning things. So I was like, that doesn't make any, that doesn't make any sense to me. Like, I met this boy at church. And, why, like, why? It doesn't make any sense. Um, I tried to ask about those books and never got a straight answer as to why they existed in the Catholic Church, but not others. Wait, what? Most libraries have religious texts available. Support oh, yep. Yep. That's true, too. That's true. Uh, okay. Let me clear out bags. All right. So we got our one or 200 clay. Suck on that. Uh, unicorn cuddles. I got you. I got you. <laughs> Thank you, nice. I have that death thing with one of my brother's best friends. After my brother died, he turned to religion and condoned a lot of things that were that are otherwise wrong. Yeah, it. I found out, um, and I didn't really know how I how I felt about it um but i found out i want to say it's been a couple years now because i think it was before the pandemic but i found out like he i i had run back into him years later like i like i was in college and um and i had run back into him and apparently he was real big into heroin and um he OD'd and passed away and like I'm not saying that what he did is excusable and and that it's not wrong because it was um, but I think it's sad that that happened to him I I think it's really unfortunate that his life took that turn and that it went that way. And I know it's not my my job, it's not on me to to have saved him or anything like that, but you know, it it still sucks 
it still sucks to, th to think about it, you know? Um, Alright, let's go cook some berry salad. The extra books in Catholic religion are called... Uh, which don't exist outside of ca Catholicism? <laughs> Interesting. Alright, I am going to make some berry salad. I wish I could set... Like, I I've said this before, I wish I could craft multiple... Like, I, I really do. I wish it would be like, okay, I've got the ingredients. Let's make 10 of these. And then it does that. Catholic Church has a lot of uh, different ideas about it, especially as revering the saints and Mary along with their ceremonies. And Oh, my God. It's been on a wild ride. Yes, it has. I have a friend celebrating three years clean today. It's pretty great to see them so excited for life. It's a difficult to do it. Yeah. It's, it's very... It, I mean, it's it's scary. It's it's scary. And I mean, I'm I'm sorry that that happened to him. And I really wish that he'd been able to get the help and support that he really needed to process losing his dad that young, and being put in that position because he had two or three younger brothers. And so, I mean, he was, he was, thir we were 13. Like, we were, we were young. Um, so, I mean, it was, that, that was hard. That was hard to go through. It was hard on his mom and everything, but, like, it was hard on him, too. And I wish that he had gotten, I wish that things had turned out differently for him. My grandparents don't consider Catholicism to be Christian. Oh, gee. Potato Thanksgiving in your family must be so fun. I guess I should say holidays in general must be so fun. <laughs> All right. I have plenty of berry salads now. My great aunt grew up in Ch Chicago, Italian Catholic. God, they are. <laughs> oh, hello. All right, let's hang out later. Yep, I know. It's always oh, great sweet. spending time with me. I'm the fucking best. Okay. Let's go here. How's it going? It's going goofy. Yeah, barely living or barely dying or I don't I don't fucking know here. Give me my money. I get here and the, the homosexual stole my name rant from Wait, the homosexual stole my name? Oh, is her name gay? Is her name gay? Because that's funny. Or is it queen? Like queenie. Her name is gay. Okay, her name is Gaynelle and she goes by gay. Oh my goodness, woman. They say people are more susceptible to addiction if they don't have a healthy support system around them, which sucks in the society that leans more on indiv yeah. individualistic mom. Yeah. Yeah. Super true. Super unfortunate. Super true. That's just like potato. Is she serious? When like I I I feel like you're gonna tell me yes she's serious, but like is is she serious when she says that? Like a hundred percent serious. I'm not going for that. He's literally I feel serious as a heart attack. Oh my god. The gay stole my name. Oh, the homosexual. So stupid. Yeah, she stole their name. They've been gay a lot longer than she's been around. Hate to break it to you, ma'am. Hate to break it to you. Actually, I don't hate to break it to you. Get the fuck over yourself. <laughs> she sounds 110% serious. Jeez. Homosexuals wear. <laughs> Yeah, we do have our Sir Pride emotes that the lovely Hachine Miu did for us. But there's not just sexuality pride, there's also neurodiversity pride and autism pride because we also love our rainbow brains here. And because Squeaker is autistic and I fucking love her, I wouldn't have Sir without her, you know? Well, I mean, and she's my kid and I love her. But, oh, I got a bag! 
What I get? 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 Open the fucking bag. Oh, whoa! I like that. Who the fuck is Shank? Who the fuck is Shank? Y'all. Y'all. Uh, yes. Hold on. Hold on. Can I? Yes. Yes. Not that I don't... Look, do not, do not assume that that shake is involved in... I have thorny pants. Oh my god. You guys, I am entering an era right now. I am, I am entering an era. And I like it. That booty? Yeah, don't my butt look great? My butt's actually a bit bigger than that. But this is the closest, you know, Pixar mom bod. Koi, 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 what? Blight, what's up? What's up? What's up? What's up? Does the screen have a zoom option? It does. But it doesn't do it this time. I don't know why it went to the booba that one time. Thorny pants. Thorny pants? Yep, thorny pants. I'm still going to wear my Remy backpack because I'm super proud of this thing and I really wanted it. All right. Um. Because booba, that's why. The booba's still there. The booba is still there. All right. Next. All right. Hello, Pua, you cute little thing, you. Hello, Pua. Okay, I need to go get iron. All right, so where is any of my mining buddies? Let's go get Wally. I want to hang out with Wally. Where's Wally? Wally! Wally, where is he? Oh, he's over here. Okay, we're gonna go over here. We're gonna go get Wally because Wally's one of my mining buds, and I'm gonna I'm gonna take him with me. Oh, oh shit! What am I? I need centurions and necromancers, and I don't think I can place either one of those right now. I cannot. So we'll just level things up. I'll do a berserker. Um. I'm gonna go over here. All right. So I will do, we can do some, some vibing right here. Some vibing here. Vibing here. And we'll do vibing here. But we're not gonna do vibing here. No, that's not supposed to be vibing. Don't play shit here. Hero, welcome in. Thank you for the host. How you doing, Hero? All right, there we go. I have done it. Mm. Controller, there it is. Found it. Got it. Wally. Wally. <laughs> Hi, buddy. Let's hang out. All right, we got to go get some iron. We're going to go to the Sunlit Plateau again. We're going to hit rocks. Bud. It's either the time nor the place for vibing. <laughs> Um, guys? Guys, you good? Oh boy, oh boy. I got great gamers. Okay. Gorge. Look at all the great stuff. Okay. We vibe and we chill it all ye. Yeah, we vibe, we chill. We vibe, we chill. All right. All right, so 30 ingots. I don't know how many I have. Ooh, gems. You find more stuff for me, bud? 
Oh, aren't you the sweetest? Doing good. Just got home from work. How was work? I hope work was good. I hope it was good. All right. Give me this. I feel bad that I've basically mostly been gathering, but this is like a huge part of the game. It's just going and gathering shit. Um, oh, I should check how many iron, how many I have, honestly. Hold on. Okay, I made one. I made one. So how many ingots do I have? Hold on. It's hump day! Yes, it is. It is hump day. I have 18. Okay. I have 18, so I'm more than halfway there, but I do need, um, I do need a lot. Slightly related, does anyone have any, have to say Wednesday out of their mental voice to make sure it's spelled right? Heck and forth. Have a lovely evening. Thanks. Oh, I do all the time. Yeah. I do like when wed nest day <laughs> to make sure I don't fuck it up. Um, I've probably got enough money to fix this, but I can't. I can't because I moved it too close to that, so I can't access it. Great. Quartz, hello! Wonderful human quartz, how are you? Hello, hello. What'd you give me, Wally? Wally, you threw something. God, there's so many trees. There's so many trees. Your of course things are on fire as soon as I log in. Look. This is not my fault, okay? It was like this when I found it. It was like this when I found it. Not my fault. No panicking! We don't need to panic. We don't need to panic. Everything is fine. Everything is fine. Everything is fine. Alright. Excuse me, all of this. Uh, don't, don't, don't touch it. Just don't touch it. Just don't touch it. That. Oh, just, just don't touch it. Look, the fire doesn't burn. It's okay. What is this? I don't know, but I picked it up, and I feel like I shouldn't have. I feel like that's probably a bad idea, but I did it. I did it. Hi, Goofy. Why is Goofy just chilling in this creepy ass forest? Why is he just walking around? Okay. Okay. Ooh, I'm getting crystal from this. Ooh. An elegant gazebo. That looks epic. I want to make that. I'm gonna put that in my in 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 my garden. I'm gonna put that in my garden. Heck yeah. I don't know why I'm pretending like I can whistle. I can't whistle. I can't whistle. I suck. I can't. It's not something I am uh, genetically capable of doing. The store makes fun of me for it all the time. An elegant gazebo, does that mean we have to raise our pinkies while shrinking? Fuck yeah, it does. In my gazebo. In my gazebo, that's what it means. You don't want to drink with your pinky up? You can't drink in my gazebo. Get out. Get out. You can't drink in my gazebo. Get out. That kind of got to make a ta taco meat. God, you guys are making me so hungry. Hungry. Hungry coin. I lurk and cook. Okay, enjoy your lurk. Enjoy your cooking. Give me tacos and cookies. Get a taco bell. A Kirk? Oh god. Ooh, give me the white ones. I don't know what I'm supposed to use those for yet, but I'm stockpiling. I see what a problem wood is in this game already. Why is it every single game wood is the issue? Because it was wood wood was the issue in Cult of the Lamb, too. Remember, we could never get enough wood, but that was because y'all kept having orgies and breaking beds. Literally every night. I would wake up 
And it's like, three beds were broken last night. And I'm like, Jesus, what the fuck are you guys doing? They're not made for that kind of activity. We like, fuck it, we'll go do it somewhere else. Don't stop breaking the beds. Be adventurous. I mean, some of us were getting wood, just not the kind you needed. That is a fair point. But also... <laughs> All right. Um, I do, do okay. Oh, ooh, oh, thanks. Give me that. I'm gonna go grab uh, one of those scones from the freezer now, so that I can eat it after stream. I'll be right back. Hold on. I have it. <sighs> we were just jumping on the beds. I don't believe that for a second. I don't believe that for a second. Jumping on the beds. Mm. I'm hungry. Go make food. You're not streaming. Go make food. I wasn't trying to go to bed, like, after I eat this. <laughs> I'd totally make something after after I got off stream, but I need to go to bed because 6 a.m. Even though I try to sleep until, like, 6.30, 6 a.m. comes real heckin' quick. I'm usually able to get myself up and out the door pretty quickly, but I also don't have to be, like, kind of ready for the day. I can change back into comfy pants the second I get back in the house. It's not a huge deal for me. But. All right, let's go back here. I don't know what to eat. I didn't eat dinner. Well, uh, do you have a hankering for anything? Usually, like, if I don't eat dinner and I want to do something, like, light before bed, I really like peanut butter on toast. I think that's good. Like, like when so that... The toast is still warm, so it kind of melts the peanut butter a little bit. So just really want to know what's going on here. My bet is Cinderella. My bet is Cinderella. But I just... I don't know. Pua, you're so cute. Oh, I'm stuck. Uh-oh. 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 This is a problem. Uh oh, I'm in trouble. My inventory's full. Fuck. Uh, shit. Well, what can I very quickly get rid of? Uh, fuck carrots. Fuck carrots. I've got I, carrot seeds are so easy to get. Hi, Pua. Why were you all the way over there, bud? Ooh, why were you all the way over there? I want ice cream. Then go get ice cream. I want some cold, something cold and creamy. You're falling asleep on the couch. I offer to go get her something. Go get her some ice cream, punk. She wants ice cream. Happy International Day of Peace. Oh, Kira, thank you. Happy International Day of Peace to you too. Welcome in. How you doing? You have no proof. Purple said it, and so I believe purple. That's proof enough for me. Hey, Tom. 
welcome in. How are you, my friend? Thank you for the host. What about a smoothie, milk, and frozen fruit? Ooh, that could be good, too. That could be good, yeah. Although blenders can be kind of noisy, so you gotta be kind of careful there. Shoulder, uh, shoulder pain, but I still got a 102 followers. On That's awesome! Congratulations! Wow point? Wait, what? What? Wow coin what? I've been doing well. I saw you sass mini while lurking. How are you? Yes, I, oh, I sass mini a lot. Let's be honest. I'm doing okay. Thank you for asking. Everything's been going pretty dang good. I'm just doing some gathering so that I can try to complete Minnie's quest for this dang tower she wants. So needy. She wants this tower. What the fuck is this? A dark crystal. Ooh, ominous. Very, very ominous. Um... <laughs> you side with purple? Yes. Yes. Um, to be fair, uh, Punk, respectfully, respectfully, while you are, um, attractive, she's got booba. And I like a debooba. I like a debooba. So, respectfully, yes, I side with purple. Yes. What if Minnie is a spy and locks us in, a t in the tower? I really think I could take her. I'm pretty confident in my abilities. I, I think I could take her, actually. I think I could handle it. I do have magic after all. I'm I'm I don't know if you've noticed Fatal, but I'm pretty badass. Did you see my thorny jacket? Pretty badass. What if she's a witch with magic powers? Dude, she got her memory wiped. I think I'm good. I think I'm good, bro. I have booty. I've got booty. I don't need more booty. I got enough booty for the both of us if purple doesn't have booty. I want the booba. 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 Me and Coin are the same person confirmed. Yep. Yep. I have to side with myself. I have booba, but they are not good booba. Oh, booba, good booba. All booba, good booba. Booba come in very different shapes and all different shapes and sizes, but no booba is bad booba. All booba, good booba. Small booba? Hey! Hey! Some people got smaller boobas. Smaller booba does not necessarily mean bad booba. There are ways to enjoy small boobas. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. I'm not planting anything. Fuck off. Small booba, but you look. Everyone has their preferences. We don't body shame. We don't body shame. Everyone has their preferences. I swear to God. Why are you behind the trellis? It's not where I wanted you to go. That's not where I wanted you to go either. Why did you go everywhere but where I wanted you to go? It's not gonna let me pick it. It's not gonna let me move that. It's not gonna let me move it. It's not gonna let me. Fuck it, I'm gonna plant them. Fuck it. I'm gonna I'm gonna fucking plant them. I'm gonna, I'm just gonna plant them. Gynecomastic. What, what is that? 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 I'm not I don't I don't know I don't know medicine stuff. 
Coin is resisting smiting the game. The, the funny game deserves to be smited. Wally, my bed, my, my my bud, Wally, move, move, please. Thank you, thank you, Wally. I mean, you didn't actually move, but thank you. Hey, Plague, how's it going? It's when men have enlarged breasts. I mean, men got boobs too. Men can get breast cancer. Booba. Booba. I'm really sick today? Oh, I'm sorry to hear that, Plague. Even if it is fitting for your name. I'm sorry to hear that. I hope that you're able to feel better soon. We stand, move up. Look, we st Booba, Mooba. Short, tall, fat, skinny. Hourglass, apple, barrel, pear. You can be shaped like a carrot. I don't care. We loves you. Nothing to see here. Move along, move along. <laughs> we all about the body positivity. You'd be shaped like a carrot. No, it's fair. Because I like I remember seeing all the different like, like a lot of the times they add um, like women's clothing clothing things or where or like lingerie. They'll be like, well, what's your body type? And I'm like, ah, uh, and so they're like hourglass pear apple is apparently a shape barrel shape. Um, just all these other obnoxious things. And I'm just like, it's the body. My, my body is body shaped. I like carrots. <laughs> Hoid supports body positivity. All vegetable shapes. But I get body shamed by my siblings all the time. Well, that's because siblings are assholes sometimes. It's also probably because they're jealous of your epic bod. Nobody shaming, but as long as you got butt, I'll give it a little gander. Funk, I'm gonna bop him out. Yeah, bop him. Bop him. Bop him. Look, I remember all through school when I was growing up and constantly being like, be between my dad, which again, piece of work that my dad was, is, um, like, he, one of his nicknames for me was he would call me Fat Girl. That was that was his uh his nickname for me. And um that was that was quite a fun time uh as a very very curvy preteen and teenager. Yo, what the fuck? Yeah. 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 <laughs> yeah. So it's uh it's a it's a total wonder as to why I have any sort of body or confidence issues. Um, <laughs> but like, it's so weird to me now looking back at pictures of myself when I was in high school and middle school and just seeing how good I looked and just remembering how I felt when I was in that place in my life, because I felt ugly and fat and shameful. And I wasn't, you know, I wasn't one of the the size twos or size zeros or whatever. I, you know, I, I was always like size nine, size, size 11. Um, Cause I, I just, I had curves. I, I, I'm from a very curvy, like my genetics are just from a pool of very curvy women. And I was ashamed of that. But now it's like, I love my boobs. My boobs are awesome. And while I'm still struggling to accept my body, it gets a lot easier. It, 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 it's a lot easier than it was. But yeah, like that that's that's what I grew up with, okay? <laughs> koi look left, koi look right, koi look down. 
Now fist pump rocket girl. I gained weight in six years of being with a lovely per Oh yeah, I definitely got fat and happy, quote unquote, with uh with Serm. I think I gained about 30 or 40 pounds. Um when I met Serm because I felt comfortable and uh Hey turtle! Weight goes up and down. Yeah, <laughs> you're still you. And honestly, weight... Weight can just be a number. And the whole, like, BMI thing is total bullshit. Because one, it's outdated as fuck. And two, all the calculations for, uh, for BMI, no matter what they tell you, are based on men. And women's body chemistries are made differently. We have extra fatty tissue. Booba! We have booba! And so we carry weight differently, but it doesn't mean, mean that, like, I'm 5'2". They want me, do you know what a healthy weight is for, for someone of my height? 112 pounds. I haven't seen 112 pounds since I was in maybe early high school, probably middle school. I just haven't. And I probably never will. And it is absolutely ludicrous. Like, it's just, it's fucking... Ludicrous. What? Luda? <laughs> Play the hype. Yeah, we all need our lives. Mm -hmm. As long as you are otherwise healthy and you are confident and happy in the skin you're in. Don't worry. Don't worry about a number on a scale. Quite honestly, I haven't weighed myself in a long time. And I have the urge sometimes, but I also know that if it's like I'm I'm still in a place where seeing the number will make me feel a way about myself. And it's 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 not about that. I want to feel good in whatever clothes I wear. I want to feel like my husband is attracted to me. And trust me, I feel that. So that is not an issue. Um, but other than that, like I'm I'm good. I'm good. Mm. Could you just starve yourself? That'll be healthy. Um, but these are fucking delicious, so no. Also, bread. I, it's every time I'm always like it. it uh, Scott Curl, uh, Scott Pilgrim. Bread makes you fat. Yes, carbs. So I've had to lose weight to become healthier. Uh, I was all the way up to 222. I'm down to 198 now. That's awesome. Queen, please, I'm 5'3", and my kids in depression haven't let me go below 180 in years. And I bet you're gorgeous, purple. Like, 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 I, I, I bet you're gorgeous. Like, hey. Hey. <laughs> bread makes you fat. <laughs> but bread is so good. So fucking worth it. Oh, I thought oh you were trying to get my, my attention. You're not a fat. You're sexy, though. You're sexy as fuck. I love you. Not the bridge. I will gladly sacrifice my uh, attractiveness for bridge. I know I need to keep some fat on there. I know. I love you. All to bridge? Yep. All to bridge. Look, I like at this point, I just have to... I have to keep... I have to keep eating and ke like, like Sturm said, I have to keep fat on me because otherwise, how am I going to fill out these um, awesome bras that, that I get, you know? Like they don't make bras with padding for my size. They just don't, not that I need it. Like they just don't, they don't make bras with padding. So I need to actually fill out the cup, you know? <clears throat> Stop it, Koi, she's mine. Yeah, it's because I'm allowed to flirt. Gosh, I'm not like don't be wrong. I'm 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 just flirting. I am happily married. <laughs> Sourdough bread intensifies. I would love to do like a bread making stream too. Oh, um, I think I talked about this before, but I want to just bring it up again. Have you you guys? Would you guys be interested in doing plate up? So plate up um is this? It's kind of it's it's like a roguelike kind of game. But it's cooking. 
and there's like there's really cool chat integration with it and i really want to give it a try it looks like a lot of fun bread and bread and taters the tri well, i was gonna say the the trifecta but it's more like a dynamic duo but yes all of the yes <clears throat> It's on my it's on my wish list. I haven't bought it, um, but I was thinking it would be something that we could try out in uh, in November. Why are you making us hungry with bread? Um, because then maybe somebody will will get me a uh, a, a bread bouquet. The purely selfish reasons. Best grilled cheese is always sourdough Boy, and gouda. Oh, grilled cheese! Grilled cheese now. It sure, it sure don't blue. I mean, it's technically the carbs that make you fat if you don't burn them off. But yeah, I love grilled cheese. We have some uh, some tomato soup upstairs. Mm -hmm. Might make a grilled cheese tomorrow for lunch if I get. That's not Bredge's fault. That's fair. That's not Bredge's fault. That's fair. That's fair, uh, Matt. That's fair. Not Blue. All right. Can I please? You son of a whore! Hate everything. All right, I'm gonna I'm gonna go find one of these hummingbird things. See if I can give it a piece of sugar cane. See if it likes it. Burb, burb. Hey burb, burb. Hey burb, 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 burb. Okay, you're a green and yellow burb. I saw a blue burb. Oh, blue burb. Hold on, blue burb. Oh, I wonder if they like vanilla. Could try that too. Burb, burb. Hey, burb. Hey, burb. Burb, burb. Hi, hi. You're pretty, pretty burb. With this. Hey, listen. Okay, he did not want that. I'm kind of mad. Link, hey. Glad I caught you literally the next day. That's so awesome. My goodness, hi. How are you? Welcome in. I'm glad that you got to stop in too. I was not expecting that. Guys, Link is an awesome streamer. He's actually, uh, well, I don't want to, I guess I don't want to spill beans if he hasn't checked his email yet. Um, but I was hanging out in Link's stream early, so, so today, for me, earlier today, and we were playing some Fall Guys, and um, really, really awesome dude. Promises are promises. <laughs> I do appreciate that. Um, he was doing some Fall Guys. And um, was I was rocking to the playlist the entire time. He had on like some some old time like there the old all time low. Uh, Lincoln Park was on there, and it's very good playlist, very good time, great conversations. And and you guys know how we are big on stack up, right? Well, Link is active duty Air Force, and is actually certified for mental health um support like mental health support um in the military and that's fucking cool so definitely give him a check out uh okay that's gonna be last stream raiders for the night because it's almost 11 and coin has to get ready for bed soon yes yes we we very much preach our uh, our military and we are very supportive of the uh, of the mental health um we big on that here. Okay. Uh, all right. So that's that. <laughs> but yeah, Link is pretty cool, dude. So check him out. I really enjoyed the vibes in his stream, and I will definitely be hanging out there more. <laughs> Hula. Okay. Uh. Okay. So it didn't like sugar cane. All right. Well, fuck you then, Burb. Sorry, Quetz. All right, I want to do something. But let's go fit. Oh, I need to get the iron, but I kind of just want to go fishing. I kind of want to fish. All right, Wally, I love you. You are Bay. 
But we're, we're, we're gonna hang out later, okay? I'm sorry! I don't want to disappoint you! I'm so sorry! Okay. Okay, oh, tree. There's a tree. There's a tree. Look, directions are hard, too. Uh, I need to level up Donald and Maui, I think. Maui, definitely. Maui is fishing. What did I make Donald? Donald is gathering. Okay, we're taking Maui. Where's Maui? Wally can Netflix and chill next time. <gasps> How dare you? Wally is bae. He's innocent bae. How dare. Blight, we don't Netflix and chill with Wally. We don't Netflix and chill with Wally. We gotta put a ring on Wally. Don't you dare disrespect Netflix. What does that mean? Oh, Matt. Oh, sweet summer child. He won't be after next date. <laughs> Light. Light. I'm not looking for you, Scrooge. Where is Maui? He's huge, so I should not miss him. He left, didn't he? He fucking left. You know what? Fuck it. I'm gonna buy this shirt. I'm gonna buy it. Uh, Eve the White Robot? Yes. Yep. Eve is the white robot. I haven't. She's <clears throat> so you, far not you. in this. Like she, but um, it, I think they should. I, I would definitely appreciate them adding her, but so far she's not in this. Actually, hold on. Do I want to buy this? Not this. Do I want this fireplace? It is very chonky. And I don't want, I don't necessarily love like Mike and Sully being the only things on there. I would like to add different pictures. Uh, it means we it means we hide outside Mickey's bedroom when we're enjoying free Netflix. <laughs> Mickey watches some weird stuff, but hey, free Netflix. It, yeah, wouldn't he have Disney Disney Plus? That's fair. He's taking a break from watching animated stuff for a while. There's more. Than, hey, they got National Geographic stuff on Disney Plus. Not just animated stuff. Plus, don't they have like all the Disney Channel original movies on there too? Ooh, look. My just read your email, by the way. I was chuckling out loud <laughs> to the beep it. Okay, I have to share this. When so when I first so I was scouting. Now that he's read the email and and I can talk about it. Um, when I was scouting, the very first thing that I saw when I clicked onto Link stream, you guys know how I have my onesies, right? Link has a B onesie. And I came in on him twerking in the B onesie because he had technical difficulties because Phasmophobia crashed. And it was just so funny <laughs> that I like I just I, I was like, yep, okay, we're gonna like it here. <laughs> it was very funny. I could not Phasmo crash shocker, <laughs> Matt. <laughs> he was playing Asylum, so apparently, yeah, playing the Asylum. Uh, asylum is still fucked. But there is an update coming soon where it should get fixed. Which is why when we be doing mod games on Friday, we will not be playing the Asylum map. I will not be murdering you guys in, a, in Asylum yet. Literally, I'm glad it's not just me. <laughs> no, it's not. Yeah, I know. I know. We're going to hang out, bud. Let's hang out. Fuck off, Gothel. You. You. I hate you. Get out of here. You don't deserve this. This isn't okay, for you. Shut the fuck up. This isn't for you. This is for Minnie and Mickey. I'm going to push you out. Hold on. I'm going to push you out. Maui, move. Let her get her out. Get her out of here. Set your hair on fire if I could, but it's a Disney game, so I can. But in my dreams. She's going to murder us? Um, well, I mean, I did not receive my... Um, I, I didn't... I am you're not in danger, turtle. I wouldn't murder you. But yeah, um, Adir, I did not receive my bridge, um, my bridge bouquet, um, my offering. I did not, I did not receive it. So yes, I will be murdering you in Faz on Friday. Set your hair on fire with an interesting thread. <laughs> Look, it makes you feel powerful, okay? <laughs> looking forward to the Asylum rework? Me too. I'm really looking forward to it. Oh, Coin's not going to murder us on the map for not playing. <laughs> Isn't that animated Hercules movie a Disney production? Hades' hair is on fire? That's true. 
I don't know where you live. How can I send you an offering? Unfair. You know Sturm. You know Waze. Look, I don't need to understand the logistics of how it would happen. I'm just saying. I'm kidding, Adir. I mean, I'm still going to murder you, but I'm kidding about the, uh, the, the offering. See, I provided Branch and I know murdered. That is true, but also Fatal, you haven't been... No, no, Fatal... Fatal's been there when we played. Never mind. I was going to say, Fatal hasn't been there for when we've done Trash Panda TV nights. Except when we summon him with Bang. Sir would ever betray you to the Chaos Brothers? Light, do you... Have you met Sturm? He would encourage the shit out of you guys. I have a new friend. I have a new friend. I have a new friend. Hey, 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 hey! Havel, welcome on in. Thank you for the follow. Welcome, welcome. Ooh, from Link. Link, thank you. That's so sweet. So I'll double check. Uh, Havo cost is like, what would you prefer me to call you? But also, Link, thank you so much. That's so sweet. See, I watch using Mrs. Fatal's TV, so I'm always interested to you. But you're not in the Discord talking with us. Whatever things are revealed, we need to do. Uh, we need to decide what the fuck we're watching next. Oh wait a minute! Didn't we decide we were gonna st we were gonna wait for uh, season three of Love Is Blind to drop, and then we were just gonna start that? Because I'm, I'm sorry, the dumpster fire that is those that I, I can't look away. I just it makes me so happy. Yeah, you're not there when I'm rage quitting. That's true. That's true. I could not stop laughing when uh, when Blight rage quit because well, because Madeline chose Kobe. <laughs> He's <laughs> fucking left. And the longer he stayed gone, the more I the more laughing. Hopcast is an amazing friend I met here on Twitch. Oh, that's so sweet. Well, thank you so much for sending him over. I appreciate it. Ah, oh, fucking squid. I already have some of those. That's not what I want. Thanks, Maui. That's not what I'm looking for. I'm looking for new fish. New fish that no one's ever discovered. Put it on my head. Wear it like a hat. I fucked up the quote. It's fine. Whoa, why is this one glowing purple? Colby, I know you guys hate Colby. Hate Colby, I know. Oh, um, so Link, you remember when we were when, uh, oh, shit, oh, I almost missed that, but I got, ooh, that's new. That's new. I got one. Okay. You remember when I was talking about my friend that calls me brother or that calls everybody brother? That's Mimat. Mimat is, um, a bestie, my bestie, and I met him on Twitch. And their marriage didn't even last a year. No, their their marriage lasted. They were pregnant. You're thinking, you're thinking, um, Ayana, and J you're thinking the lo uh, the Love Is Blind season two people, not not Ultimatum. I still feel a tiny bit bad about that. No, 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 you don't have to. Like I said, I I took it as a I take it as a gender neutral term because Matt calls everybody brother, and I'm just used to it. I can understand why some people, I guess, might take offense to it, but it's, but like, I get it. For me, it's, it's very similar to dude, but it's also like, that doesn't, I, I'm, I'm, I'm a cis, I'm a cis female, so I don't take offense to it, but, oh, oh Link, thank you for the host. Thank you so much. Kind of like how many Midwesterners use guys for everyone, regardless of gender. Like, dude, yeah, I used to use I use dude all the time, but I've tried to be more cognizant of it, so I don't do it as much. Especially, I mean, like we, I'm I'm part of that community, but also like we have a lot of people in our community that are members of the Rainbow Mafia. So you know, try to try to be inclusive, and it's I mean, it's a learning process. Everybody's learning and, and adjusting, and honestly, as long as you're open to feedback and learning and adjusting, that that really counts for a lot. All right, I have to remember that there's more than three. Another squid. But we don't shout that guy out. No, no, we do. We do. Matt's awesome. I love me, Matt. Me, Matt is best. Oh, we like shouting that guy out. Me, Matt, good guy. 
Garden Witch, good guy. Heck, I'd love those two. Yeah, we do love Garden Witch. Okay, um... I am lost in the woods, or something like that. Uh, wait. Oh, I found a- wait! Ooh, hello! Oh, look, my carrot seeds. I could pick those back up. Fuck carrot seeds. I've got so many carrot seeds. Learning, <laughs> learning is hard. Yes. Indeed it is. Haha! -ha, give me anglerfish. Icy cream? Ooh, yeah. What ice cream? I was gonna say, what ice cream did Garden Witch get with the? Uh, what what ice cream did did Garden Witch get? I want to know. I want to live vicariously through Garden Witch until I can eat my scone. I started digging into the true true crime stuff when we were on about uh, yesterday, and now I feel like I've lived under a rock my entire life. Okay, so Link, are you like, do you do podcasts at all? Because. I've got a number of them that I could uh, that I could tell you about for true crime, especially coffee, toffee crunch. That sounds so good. God, I'm, I'm okay. When I have an official stream space, I am literally going to I, I'm I'm like I'm literally gonna have like a mini fridge in there, and I'm just gonna keep shit so that when you guys start talking about stuff like this, I can actually just go get it. Cause I'll just keep ice cream and cookies and shit in there. I don't do podcasts. I listen to a few at work once in a while. Okay. Uh, I mean, there's a lot of good... <clears throat> there's a lot of good TV shows and documentaries for sure. But if you were to get into podcasts, Undisclosed is a really good one. Um, they do a lot of wrongful conviction ones. Um, they Walk Among Us is another really good one. That one's more, like, European crimes. But they've got, like, they're, oh, true crime is such a rabbit hole. Look, um, I used to watch a lot of Investigation Discovery. And I will fully admit it has made me one paranoid bitch, but, um, you know... It's interesting. It's, it, it's super interesting to me. I just, I love, I love psychology and just trying to figure out how brains work and everything like that. I forgot a hole. This hole doesn't have a purpose. Fill it. Okay, feel better. Definitely noted. I have a notepad with so much random stuff on it. <laughs> yeah, if I had sticky notes, there would literally just be sticky notes all over the place. I have lists for everything. So can I just want to stream in an ice cream parlor? No. Maybe. Maybe. Would I have someone that was on staff to be able to get me ice cream when I want it? Or would I have to self-serve my own ice cream? I... Look, you guys are finding way too many quotes that, out of context, do not sound like they come from a Disney game. Last podcast on the left is good. I've heard of that one and I feel like I need to start it. Um, and my favorite murder is a is another one. I keep like I I just don't have time to listen to podcasts as much as I used to. Like when I was driving Bug back and forth to school, I would usually listen then um, because. Squeaker was young enough that I didn't have to worry about her repeating things. Um, but now, like, literally the only time I get to listen to podcasts is when I'm having, like, me time. Or if I go out in the car by myself, which is not very often. Um, so I'm usually listening to, like, my dad wrote a porno and uh, distractible and things like that. I also really need to get caught up on Dungeons and Daddies. My god, there were two of these over here? Okay. They don't sound like they come from a Disney game, but they do sound like they come from a Disney game quiz play. <laughs> it was a podcast that I... Uh, that I need to listen to. Mm -hmm. True Crime and Wooey Woo stuff. Wait, what's Wooey Woo stuff? What is Wooey Woo stuff, Fatal? Be like creepy true stories that aren't necessarily all to do with crime. It's really an ex Navy SEAL that tells stories on YouTube. Love that guy. Ooh. I would check that out. I would check that out. 
supernatural stuff. Ooh. Why are there random holes? Who the fuck is digging random holes on my... Ugh, fill your holes. Freaking fill your holes. Heathens. Heathens. It's me, Stern. Pay me to do it. God damn it. Ader, I thought we had something special. I gave you cookies. Also, it's 11. I'm digging more. God, no. Ader, no! Ader, no! You're never gonna get the spicy emote this way. Don't dig holes. I'll ban you. Fill your holes. Yep. <laughs> I gave him nachos. You hear that, kids? Fill your holes. Look. Look. Ugh. Anglerfish. Okay. Uh... Okay, so we've got like another... Because we've got tomorrow, Sunday, and then all next week of this. And then... Um... And then we're going to set Disney Dreamlight on a shelf. Or at least when it comes to stream. I'm still going to keep playing it off stream, I'm sure. But we're going to... Ooh, a shiny Play. nickel. Thank you so much for the tier one. Thank you. Vibes and banter is awesome here. Thank you so much. I really appreciate that. That means a lot. Thank you so much. <laughs> it's probably just Pluto. <laughs> We're not doing an ad right now. Fuck off. Fuck off with your ad. Oh, geez. Okay. All right. But we are going to put Dreamlight Valley up on a shelf um, because we have scary season where coin gets absolutely terrified. Oh shit, I forgot more sticks. Because Mortuary Assistant, Mortuary Assistant, um, the quarry and uh, As Dusk Falls. And if we run out of time there, we've got a whole bunch of indie games that we're gonna look into. Plus I do have Until Dawn. So you're gonna love Mortuary Assistant. I played the demo for it last year during Stack Up, actually. So when I did my uh, my event for Stack Up last year, I played the the demo and loved it. So I have been doing my damnedest to avoid spoilers, and God, has it been hard! It's been so difficult to avoid spoilers, but I've managed to do it for this long, and I cannot wait to jump into it. Mortuary Assistant is my most anticipated game to watch Queen play. Coin has a, I I do I do have a clown game, but that's more for that's that's for stack up. You guys are gonna have to raise money. You guys are gonna have to give money to charity to get me to play Slick Poo the Clown. I can't wait. This is gonna be my first scary season with Coin. Yes, I'm gonna get pumped for scary season, but it being 80 degrees out does not make you feel like it at this time. That's fair. I legitimately shot bricks playing Mortuary Assistant. <laughs> I remember I like I remember there was a clip where I'm literally looking at the shadow in the hallway and like when I when I moved away she like she moved closer or she disappeared or something so like I moved closer and she appeared and I just remember being like are you fucking with me are you fucking with me are you fucking with me and then I was like you know what I'm just gonna I'm just gonna be a big brave big brave and run forward and it like ran at me and I screamed. I love watching horror games. I get very, very... I'm a huge scaredy cat. But I will do it for charity. I am so not happy they're making killer clowns from outer space. Yeah, no, I... Uh, nope. Nope. Nope, not a coin game. Not a coin... Look, you guys are going to get Slick Poo out of me. Slick Poo the clown. If uh, if we raise enough money for charity. I will, I will do things that terrify me for charity. I will do it. Oh yeah, I screech like a six-year-old girl in caves like that. Oh jeez. Okay, I'm gonna just there we go. All right. Oof. What a night! What a heckin' stream! How we feeling, chat? How we doing? Cause it's Wednesday. Tomorrow's tomorrow's Thursday. It's Friday Eve. Well, for some of you, it's already Thursday. But right now, for me, it's still Wednesday. Let me see. Where am I gonna send you? 
Where am I going to send you? Okay. Mm. Let me double check with the mods real quick and make sure that I'm not like missing because last night they suggested somebody and uh, I didn't I didn't see it because I knew where I was going. Okay. 21st night of September. <laughs> Buddy. <-a. laughs> hey, Darren, how's it going? You came in at the end of stream, but hey. Oh, I said it five reasons I hate clowns. Oh, Jesus. Why? 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 I'm scared of being told I'm attractive. Um, punk, punk, why, why would you be scared of that? Why, why, why? Because, because respectfully, 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 you are attractive. Respectfully. Sorry. Sorry. I've been lurking for like an hour. That's okay. Lurkers are king. Fucking appreciate it. I appreciate it. I really do. Respectfully. <laughs> Look, respectful thirsting, okay? All right, um, hold on. I need to see if Riley is about to raid out because if Riley's going to raid out, then I don't want to raid. I don't want to make her stay. Oh, no, she just started. Fuck it, we're raiding Riley. We're raiding Riley. Let's fucking go. We're going to raid Riley. We're going to repay the favor because Riley raided us the other night. Riley goes to like 1 a.m. She raided me the other night, so I didn't know. Like sometimes, sometimes she's raided me and then sometimes I, I, I raid out to her, but we haven't raided her in a bit and I want to. She's playing some Octopath Traveler. Sunday, she short. It might have been Sunday that she raided then. All right. All right. So we're going to go ahead and we're going to get our raid messages ready. S raid in the S raid. If you're a sub, F raid, if you're a follower, use my emotes, your emotes, whatever. Just make sure that the raid message is the same. It's a coin raid. Self-care is awesome and so are you. Okay. Cool, cool. We gonna do that. All right. So we're gonna go raid our great friend, Riley. Riley is fucking amazing. She's adorable. And she's also one of my stack up streamers. So very, very excited uh, to work with her and do her event later this year. I'm super pumped. All right. I heckin' love you guys. Thank you so, so much for being here with me. Thank you for hanging out. As always, it's always an amazing stream. And I, I just, I appreciate the ever-loving shit out of all of you guys. I really appreciate all the new follows, all the subs, all the bits, all the love. You guys are amazing, and I love you. I hope you have an amazing rest of your Wednesday. Have an awesome Thursday, and I will see you guys tomorrow night. Where we'll play even more Dreamlight Valley because I'm still going to be, I'm like, I'm, I'm still collecting things. I'm not going to be done. I'm not going to be done. So I will see you then. I love you. Have an amazing rest of your day. Bye.